Hello, 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 and welcome to tonight's stream. Uh, today, we're going to be playing Slay the Princess. Um, we are going to be trying to get a very specific path this evening. Uh, Kenneth has a, uh, a path. I don't I didn't want to repeat path because that's poor showmanship. <laughs> uh, Kenneth has a very specific route he'd like us to try. So, um, or she, I actually don't know. I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't assume gender. They have a very specific path that they would like us to try. And uh, I don't see them in the chat at the moment. Uh, so we'll, we'll kind of just kind of stand here and, uh, kind of chat and talk about what we got going on right now. Uh, right now I am trying out this little, uh, that's me down there. That's a little avatar version of me. Sort of. He's a little glob of crap or something. What are you doing down there? Uh, this is a... Oh, crap. Oh, God. I lost myself a little bit. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, sweetheart? Sweetheart? Come here. Sorry, my cat has decided she doesn't like the fact that I have something sitting on the desk to read chat. Sweetie, I need you to get down. I know it's new, but you gotta get down. Come on. Please? Yep, yeah, come on. There you go. Just keep going. There we go. Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> what we have here is a program called Avatar Stream, Avatar Stream, Streaming Streamers Avatars. Basically, it's just a little thing for you guys to play around with while we're doing stuff that's either boring or, you know, just because you want to want to have like a little voice. Sorry, my cat is still messing around up here, coming back up here. Uh, one of my cats, anyway. So if you guys see me doing this a lot, uh, I'm trying to knock one of them away. Like, with, with, like, just throw them. You know, pick them up and throw them like that one lady did with her cat and just throw it over your back. I'm going to throw it across the room. That's a joke. I would never do that. I would, I would not do that. I know I joke about throwing animals a lot, but I wouldn't hurt an animal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, right now we have this little program, uh, Avatar, Streamer Avatar, which, you know, you get a little streamer. We're working on getting some new custom ones. This one's a little bit weird looking, actually, now that I'm, I'm getting a, a view of it a little bit better. Um, but we could do stuff like this, and uh, we could drop a little bomb on him. Yeah, die. Die, little me. Uh, but yeah, it, it's it's a fun little thing that we've got. Um, I I got to try it out with um, Mr. Beasto's chat earlier today, and it, it was it was quite fun. So uh, there's a lot of little things you guys can explore around with and give uh, give give it give it some give it some go. See, I can pick you guys up and yeah, throw you off the screen whenever you irritate me. Ugh, so angry now. Uh, but it's a lot of fun. It's 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 quite fun. We can also uh Tur Turtle has won fifteen from the jump. What? Um we can also spawn in some little goobers that are just nothing. <laughs> They're just little chat fillers. Uh this little guy comes in a lot a lot of different colors. There's also the uh default. Get rid of Okay, there's also the default little dude that I think you guys spawn in with, which is like the little square-headed guy. Uh, he'll be gone soon, so don't get too attached to him, unless you guys just absolutely love him. Uh, but before that, we're going to... Or not before that. Well, I guess technically, yes, before that. That's... Uh, oh, we're going to do that. We're going to say before that, yeah. Because <laughs> I'm definitely not going to get that in tonight. But... We're gonna we're gonna be playing some chat. So if you guys see me in the chat saying things like uh, "so and so has won 15. that's that's not me. That's a bot. Kill the bot. Do it. I want to see you guys all kill him. Yeah, this little guy's actually the bot. See, it's not even me. He's a robot. Stupid, stupid little robot. 
Um, but yeah, so we'll be doing that uh, tonight while we do our um, Slay the Princess run stream, I guess you could call it. As well as maybe some other stuff. Uh, this run probably won't take us too long. Uh, it's usually about a 30 minutes to get through like a normal run. Uh, and then we might play around with this. We might eh, we might even work on some sprites tonight. Um, I'm planning on probably only going till about 10.30 or so this evening. So we're not going to be here too long. Um, I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. As um, after we finished our stream, I decided to go and record some videos <laughs> because I uh, am neurotic. Moronic, even, is also a word for that. But let's just see here. Let's just make sure we got everything running properly. I think everything's good to go. Maybe. You, you, you. Looks like everything's okay on this end. Um, hopefully the stream is, is, is looking a little bit better. Uh, apparently every time I update uh, OBS, everything breaks on me. Every, every aspect of this program breaks on me and everything just gets completely reset. So hopefully you guys are, are not trying to fight the sound of background noise too much at least because, you know, most of my videos are actually edited uh, post uh, post. Hello! Welcome back. Or welcome to the stream, rather. And hello, welcome to you, both Kenneth and Starfall. How are you guys doing this evening? Uh, Kenneth, uh, it's just me. How's your day? My day is going very well. Uh, we've got a little stuff. Uh, I'm basically uh, just kind of stalling the stream for a little bit, letting people kind of join. Uh, and definitely you as well, because you said you have like some uh, some suggestions that you'd like us to do while we're playing Slay the Princess. So uh, I kind of kind of held off on joining the game right away. Uh, it's running in the background, so you guys can hear it. <laughs> um, hey, Starfall, you're a little dude. Uh, so, yeah, we've got this new little program. I like this game. Uh, yeah, this is a streamer avatar. This is just kind of an overlay we got going. Um, this is kind of like a test run of this. We'll be having more cool stuff. Uh, all of our little experiment dudes. Uh, Mr. Starfish, this game is the game <laughs> sorry uh this game is the game i like it too also you have little guys yes we do uh yeah there there are little you, those are your avatars actually um i'm not sure if you guys scroll up in the chat there may be it still might be there i'm not sure if it's still there but there is a link so that you guys can go in and customize your little avatar however you see fit I really like this game. Like, love it. LOL. Uh, Slay the Princess or Streamer Avatar? <laughs> They're both kind of games. I'm sorry. And I've, I've got a new monitor. Not a monitor, but I put a tablet over onto the side. So uh, I have a, muster, a mustache in my head is square. That's so cute. <laughs> Slay the Princess. Slay the Princess is so good. I love Slay the Princess. Um... Hopefully, I'm not sure how well the delay on this all is, but hopefully I'm fixed that a little bit. Uh, there's not a whole lot I could do to get the delay, so this will also kind of help you guys see when I'm seeing your chats or when I should see your chats, so that way you're not too worried about whether or not I actually am paying attention because I'm probably not. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we'll be playing Slay the Princess. Uh, and like I said, there's an extension if you guys want to play around with the Avatar thing, if you're bored. Uh, of watching this hopefully you don't get bored but even if you're not you can still play around with the avatar stuff a lot of fun things uh let me just real quickly uh pick one of you little dudes up and oh no i didn't mean to do that get out of here you little globs i'm gonna pick you up kenneth spin you around a little woo uh, will this little people be permanent? Um, yeah, if we can get it working, this will now be like a permanent thing. You guys will have like uh, some money that you can use to buy avatar stuff. Um, the little globs don't have 
any accessories right now as I'm still working on them. They're kind of just a test. Um, but you guys will get like you can buy things. There's other mini games that we can do like in the downtimes and things like that. So hopefully you guys enjoy this. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and drop some stars in there so you guys can earn some coins. So when we do get accessories, you can buy them. Uh, this anything I set up in this will not be in-game purchases uh well not you you won't need to use any money it's just points you earn by being in the chat <laughs> just a heads up that's so cool if there uh there will i'm sorry i can't read that's so cool there will be here in the future correct yes yes oh and uh i just posted the stream extension so that should post every so often in case you guys need to get in and you want to play around with your avatars uh, that said, I've I've also got more custom avatars coming in the future. Nothing is purchased right now. You guys have access to everything that there is right now. And in the future, we're going to have some other avatars. We're going to have a little dinosaur, uh, little things like that, little globs, little prison men, uh, zombies, all kinds of stuff. Uh, there won't be a lot of a huge amount of them because I have to make them all. But we'll be we'll be making stuff. So, without further ado. I think it's time we jump into Slay the Princess. Well, we would if I had actually set this up properly. Oh my god. Sorry for the delay today as well, everyone. Uh, I Once again, I had technical issues constantly. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm inept when it comes to technology. We want the game capture to be... Slay the princess. And um, so tonight we're going to be, we're not going to be going too late tonight. Uh, probably closer to 1030 ish. Uh, maybe later if I get in, in my, my, uh, in my mindset <laughs> to get in that. I'm, yeah, I'm in the, I'm in the zone auto zone. So let's see. Is that not working? Slay the princess. Yes, please work. I would like I would like to play Slay the Princess, please. I have princesses to murder. There we go. Everything's back up and running. And uh once again, hopefully the delay on the chat's not too bad. So whatever horrors you may find. Uh let's go ahead and load the game. I uh, may have given you guys some information here on whenever I last played this. Uh, let's see. It was April the 7th. All right. Four. I'm sorry. I don't. I, a four. I'm trying to remember what that was, what I asked or what I said. Oh, you're telling me which one to pick, right? Um, I'm on three out of five princesses. Uh, which princess have I done? Um, so far, if like, I'm going to have to remember this. We have gotten the last princess we got was the stranger, I think, which I absolutely loved that one. That one was so cool. Um, the it was like a horrifying demon that rips her skin off I don't remember what that one was and uh, we've also got an ending in which we just fell into the void uh, you've done the th uh, you've done the theory you've done the a few others the theory oh is, uh, the fury is that it the fury maybe And I think we also got, on the same ending, we got the... We've only met with her like three times, the goddess. And one of those times was nothingness. Uh, so I'll try not to make too many quick choices here. And I'll wait for chat to keep up, or catch up. Or the stream to catch up. Yes. Okay, cool. Uh, all right. Uh, you're here to slay her. If you don't, it will be the end of the world. Once again, I love this music. It's so 
peaceful. Uh, and I think uh, Kenneth tonight will be guiding us through a a route that they would like to see, which I am excited to see as well. Because there's, like, I don't know how many there actually are, but I've seen uh, spoilers for like one or two of them via Steam, as some people, or not some people, <laughs> somebody forgot to that they were playing the game and uh, was just clicking around me. <laughs> but so chat disconnected. Right. Great. Let me just see if I can get this chat over here open working. I might have to grab my phone real quick and do it that way again. Okay. <laughs> so that, that solution didn't work. I'll, I will set up my phone real quick. Give me guys just uh, one second. Constant technical issues. Thir we're already 30 minutes into the stream and I have broken everything. You know, best laid plans and all that. So I apologize if I'm not responding. Actually, hang on. I could just open this up and look at it. So there we go. I can at least see some chat coming through right now or now. Oh, you guys are adorable in there. I'm very cute. The other are as... Uh, unfortunately, that cut off a little bit for me. I'm going to say as well, right? As well. Okay, great, great. Awesome. All right, so I've got my tiny chat going. Uh, every once in a while, I'll have to pick up my phone and read it. Uh, so hopefully you guys will be able to bear with me. Cool. Cool, that is some nasty water I just drank. All right. Let's let's get back into it. All right. So is there any particular route we need to take for right now? Or is this like a chapter two deal? Do, do, do. I just love this background music. It's so peaceful for such a creepy game. Uh, you can pick whichever one you want, but I want the first one. The first one. The end of the world? What are you talking about? Have I turned around yet? Yes, that was actually the first true ending we got. Um, <laughs> I don't, I'm not exactly sure how to say it. Um, please and thank you. Um, we turned, we got our first one. We got her. She turned into like a I'm creepy ghost. The end of everything as we know it. No more birds, no more trees, and perhaps most problematically of all, no more people. You have to put an end to her. Uh, but yes, we and then we left and then got sucked into the void. Uh, which I think was an absolutely perfect start to this game. But, you know, that's just me. I'm going to go ahead and just turn this off. <laughs> I'm trying to keep... Oh, wait. There, yeah, no, I screwed that up. Okay, so um, I'm not sure if it if it matters where we're going from here. Um, 
I want to make sure I do get your ending at least. Uh, seeing as it looks like we're going, we're close to an end. Uh, the one chapter I would like you to have is called The Razor. Okay. Um, The Razor. But first, I want you to get your true ending. My true ending? Okay, so just kind of go with what I want. Anything I think of. If, if I walk in there and uh, immediately start stabbing the princess, everyone's going to be happy. <laughs> Have you considered, is there any options I haven't picked yet? Anything's fine for now? Okay, cool. Uh, have you considered that maybe the only reason she's going to end the world is because she's locked up? I think we've seen all this. I think we've seen kind of like all the lore. Uh, there's a way to win without doing nothing at all. Wait, with? Without? Okay, interesting. Uh, forget it. I'm not doing this. Uh, have you considered that maybe do I get some sort of reward? You know what? Maybe we should complete that one that I got first. That one, I, the first one I started down. Okay, I'm sold. Let's get it over with. As long as you remain focused on your goal, it should all be smooth sailing. Okie dokie. You make your way up the short path to the cabin. You'll find the princess within. Cool. Of course. We're going to go through with this, right? She's a princess. We're supposed to save princesses, not slay them. Um, listen, dude, I have slayed so many princesses. He doesn't know what he's talking about. All you need to do is kill her, and that's just... And that's it. Just leave, but before you leave, you need to save the game. Oh, okay. So, you need to do is kill her, and that's it. Just leave. And save the game. Okay. I'll go ahead and save here. Uh, I'll keep like we'll we'll switch over to page two and we'll just keep saving. <laughs> we'll, we'll keep saving a lot of them. I'm not I'm not above save scumming. The interior of the cabin is almost entirely bare. The air is stale and musty, and the floor and walls are painted in a fine layer of dust. The only furniture of note is a plain wooden table. Perched on that table is a pristine blade. Uh, what's my favorite voice? Oh, it is absolutely the um, the one we just got. Uh, I forgot what it was. Contraterror. Con con oh my god, I cannot say that word. Contra 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 contrarian. Contrarian. That's the word. Uh, the blade is your implement if you want to do this right. Well, I guess we're going to have to go in and fight. The blade. Oh, that rhymed. Your You'll need it if you want to do this right. Oh, did you, you just have this memorized? <laughs> That's, um... You take the blade from the table. It'd be rather difficult to slay the princess and save the world without it. I think this is actually the first time I've taken... No, I think I took it the second time. The door to the basement creaks open revealing a staircase faintly illuminated by an unseen light in the room below. Ooh. This is an oppressive place. The air feels heavy and damp, a hint of rot filtering from the ancient wood. If the princess really lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. You know what? Slaying her would be her doing her a favor. Let's stab her in the head. Uh, yes, I did remember. <laughs> And uh, you picking first. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Sorry. <laughs> That's cool, though. Who's there? It's me. I'm back to it's kill nice. you. Dangerous. It's almost as if she's the one in charge down here. Don't let it fool you. It's all. Oh, that's right, because she, she acts this way when I have the sword. You know what? I think I'm going to respond with. Hello. Oh, are you now? Why don't you come down and let me take a look at you? Ooh. Rachel, you gave away the element of surprise. 
Good luck, hero. Well, why did I need surprise anyway, exactly? You stop, stop, stop! And lock eyes with the princess. There's a heavy chain around her wrist, binding her to the far wall of the basement. Uh, let's see, you may not heard of this voice, but I like the voice of the paranoid one. The paranoid voice. I'm... I don't think we got the paranoid one. I think we got the coward or something like along those lines when we got our first ending of this game. Or it wasn't really an ending, but the first time we played. She's so coldly beautiful. Is she really a threat to the world? I'm still not convinced she is. I think this is some sick game the narrator is playing. You weren't kidding when you said you were here to kill me. What? Why, why would you think I'm messing with you? I'm not here to mess with you. We're friends. We've we've done this over and over again. Uh, what? No way. Why would I even think that? <laughs> yeah, it wasn't a joke. I haven't decided yet. I'm just here to talk. Steal your nerves and step forward. What? No way. Why would you ever think? I would have fucked with her this time. Gives it away, no! The blade. Of course she doesn't want to talk. Who'd want to have a conversation <laughs> at knife point? Uh, also, comment. just a quick uh, caveat for tonight. I am drinking coffee right now, and I get extremely jittery and um, weird on coffee. <laughs> So, we're going to have fun. So, are you picking the first, or am I going to pick? Uh, I guess I will do the first one, and we'll do yours next, if that's okay. Is most of them you picked is with a knife? Um, I think it's kind of an even mix. Sort of. Don't you dare. It's fine. We can decide what we want to do after we talk to her. Maybe she really is a monster. Killing someone in cold blood isn't very becoming of us. You know what? I think tighten my grip. You ignore the trembling in your hands and tighten your grip on the blade. Stab, stab, stab. You poor thing. Your hands are shaking. Are you scared of me? No, it's cold because in here. You be. Can't you see my bird like nipples showing through my shirt? It's extremely cold. You step your grip on the blade tightening as you steal your resolve. I'm probably chained up in this basement for a reason, right? And if uh, that knife is the only weapon you have, you'll have to get close enough to use it. That's a good point. So, you should just drop it. Best not to risk finding out what I can do. Hmm. She's unarmed. If you hesitate now, it'll be too late. Drop the blade, slay the princess. I'm not dropping the blade. I'm sorry, can we just talk? Are you sure she's not armed? What if she isn't bluffing? What if she kills us? Going to this expecting to die. You're going to die. Oh, okay, fair point. Uh, sorry, my chat is acting a bit weird. I'm thinking my internet might be a little bit goofy today. So hopefully you guys are seeing all everything without too many interruptions. Uh, show me chat. Oh, so far I'm picking the razor myself. <laughs> oh, okay, excellent. Uh, well then. Uh, the stream is mostly fine right now on my end. Okay, good. Um, I know I, my internet's not the best. They're actually looking into getting us some fiber optic cable in this town. So what hopefully at some point we'll get that. The two of us can be civilized with each other. Oh, I don't know. You'll pick me a different one. Okay, well, um, let's. I may not end up with the the bla the razor, so we'll we'll just kind of keep going. And if I get the razor, then we'll pick a different one. Um, I'm not dropping it. Then I'm not talking to you. 
You bitch! <laughs> Squint at the princess while holding onto the blade. Yeah. Stare at the princess, squinting. This is actually a very me situation here. Oh man, this is like a standoff between me and my sister. Do this forever, aren't you? Oh yeah. Squint at the. <laughs> you squint even harder. Oh, this is great. Dang. Oh, never mind. We're getting something else. Okay. All right. So does she. <laughs> At least nobody's dying right now. You're going to have to make a choice. You can't keep squinting forever. What if I do, though? Someone is going to have to blink. Oh, my God. Is he going to take over? The blade tumbles out of your trembling hands and drops to the floor with an unceremonious clang. Thank you. Maybe now we can just talk. No, no, I'm dropping to my knees and, and grabbing. Oh, the fuck. Judgment. It's not going to give me the option. You step forward to speak with the princess face to face. You want to kiss? Unarmed. I still don't like your eyes, dude. We'll be fine. Don't know what you're hoping to accomplish here, but I can assure you there's no reasoning with her. Just make sure you don't forget about the blade on the floor. You're going to need it. Okay. So here we are. What an awkward start to a relationship. Oh, we're in a relationship now? Uh, yeah, it's uh, pretty awkward. Nah, this isn't awkward. This is better than most relationships I've seen. Uh, are we coming? Are you coming on to me? Yeah, that's actually. Don't jump to any weird conclusions. We're two people who have met each other. By definition, we have a relationship. Uh, by my relation, by my definition, that's a romance. How would I get you out of here? I'm here because you're supposed to end the world. There are people out there who think you're going to end the world. Yeah, I've seen all this. Uh, what's your name? We've seen that. How long have you been down here? Okay, we've talked enough. Oh. Sorry, I didn't see... Uh, let's... Uh, let's go. You dropped the blade. Uh, Sun God Nika. Hi. Hello. Welcome to our chat. Uh, welcome to the stream and all that good stuff. Uh, I hope I hope you stick around and have a good time. If you don't, as long as you're having a good time, I'm happy with that. <laughs> That's all that matters. Uh, today we are playing Slay the Princess, and we're going to be trying to get uh, a couple endings here. Uh, there's people out there who want to think, uh, blah, we just read that. What's your name? Uh, okay, we've talked enough. <laughs> Do you know why I'm here to kill you? Do you? Mm, oh, I'm pretty sure I'm here to kill you because a god's asking me to. I know what I've been told, whether or not I believe it is entirely another... No. You're lying. How does she know that? Wait. Don't think that just because I'm the one in chains, it means you have a right to interrogate me. Okay. Okay, what's your name? How would I get you out of here? Don't bother. You're absolutely welcome. Uh, just a heads up, my uh, my chat's a little delayed, so if if I, if it takes me a minute to respond, it's because I'm both you don't have the key then. easily distracted I'm and sure all that. Somewhere around here, and if there isn't, wait, wait, wait. Well, we can always put that knife to good use. Yeah, we Her can. Eyes settle on the edge of the blade. She isn't suggesting what I think she's suggesting. Stab her in she the head. Is. I'm sure of it. Uh, how long have you been down here? Honestly, I don't think any of this matters. Okay, we've talked enough. Oh, have you decided what to do with me? Not really, honestly. I'm not you getting a good vibe in thing. either way yet. Okay, let's get her out of here. I don't think we've ever left with her. Uh... Mr. Turtle, look at me. What? Who? What? 
Oh no! <laughs> You've changed! You've degraded into a blob! <laughs> Let me just pop over here and we'll uh, throw you guys some stars. Everybody get stars now! I don't know how you catch them. Uh, what's the game about? Um, this game is all in the title, really. Uh, this is Slay the Princess. We are here to slay the princess and uh, talk to her. And I'm going to run my finger across her cheek, being really creepy before I kill her. Uh, basically, this is like a kind of a uh, visual novel kind of game that has multiple endings that seem to all kind of line together. Uh, we're going to kill the princess or maybe not. In some cases, she might kill us. All kinds of cool stuff going on. Really creepy. It's got horrible, creepy vibes. And if you are not comfortable with uh, the whole gore and violent, I apologize. Oh, and it's a love story. Yes, it is a love story. <laughs> uh, yes, it's basically a love story. Yeah, it is a love story. And I am going to make her fall for me. Uh, because you walk I need her binding the princess for the wall and give them a tug. something very important to me. The person They're I love. Heavy, far too solid for you to even imagine trying to break them apart. If you don't have the key, maybe you should go looking for it. Can I find a key? Upstairs. Doubtful. Whoever locked the princess away down here intended for her to never see the light of day. They wouldn't have just left the key to her chains somewhere in the cabin. And it's nice at the end. Oh, that's good. That is good. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping this ends up with a scenario in which I end up with my, um, my sweet, beloved goddess of hands. Uh, I remember everything, even the endings and how you get every princess. I think there is 12. 12? I know that they said they're going to update with some extra ones as well. It's nice at the end if you pick correctly. Oh, no. No spoilers. Gotcha. <laughs> so we are going to be doing a run uh, that Kenneth would like to see us do. So they're going to be giving us some, uh, some directions. Uh, I'm going to go upstairs. Maybe the key's still lying around somewhere up there. If I'm not, maybe I can at least find something to break free. I'll be here. All right. Bye. You attempt to God, make I... your way out of the basement. God, I hope the door she dies. The, the stairs slams shut. You hear the click of a lock sliding into place. <laughs> I didn't when we got this the last time, I thought that this was like just actually somebody up there. I didn't realize it was actually the narrator. Hey, let me out. You're here to slay the princess, and you won't leave until the... Try the door. But it's locked from the outside. Yeah, I'll it is. Once again, you're here to slay the princess, and you won't leave until the task is done. Fine. You Mr. Narr... I'm really the wanting the narrator to be dead. We kind of killed him so last time. Easier if you'd simply slain her uh, I like the princess. Uh, can I show you... Two types of princesses in one ending? Uh, sure. If we're still able to get it, sure. Uh, you tried the door, but it's locked from the outside. Oh, right. Got you. Yeah, that's just what happened. Okay. Uh, I, I like the princess. I mean, the princess is great, but I, I think... And I feel bad for her, but, you know, there's... Easier for whom? your mom Easier for everyone uh there's just i heard the door slam they lost there's only one too, didn't they? woman for me the knife pick it up and cut me out of here <laughs> without hesitation you bring the blade down Die, princess. I'm sorry, Starfall. I had to do it. Something deep inside of me wanted a death. <laughs> yes, I don't. I forgot that the door slammed as well. So that's pretty impressive. You bastard. No, you won't. I thought we had the upper hand, but it's as if she's barely even threatened by us. 
You see, at the beginning, they said that I ruined my element of surprise. <laughs> uh, yeah, sorry. Sorry, uh, son. Son God. Um, this is the one I wanted to show you. Oh, really? Is this it? I'm so sorry, everyone. Well, we're doing, we were going to have to do it anyway, I guess. Uh, I'm, I'm a sociopath. I'm so sure. <laughs> Don't waver now. As you raise your blade to strike again, she kicks out, knocking your legs out from under you. The two oh! Of you struggle on the ground. Oh, we've seen this one. This is where she kicks my ass. You can. Her fists connect with your body again and again, each blow stronger than the last, shattering bone and rupturing tissue with reckless abandon. Forget oh. trying to rescue her. This is about survival now. Give her everything you've got. All right. Uh, you're going to get the beast. Oh, the beast. Uh, she kind of low-key bad. Um, you're going to get the beast. Shh. Give up. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna, I'll keep... Uh, I don't... I don't have the option to give up. ...and shakily push yourself back to your feet. I'm afraid, so I'll have to keep Though going. Each of you is in pain. The princess probably has it worse. Blood pours out from countless gashes, staining her once pristine dress. This one will she be the uh, adversary, I think. Breath, staring at you with wild eyes. We can still turn this around. Shink, shink. Can we? Oh. Oh, I. <gasps> I have no option. I have to give up because I've already done this. These two routes, I guess. Are you serious? Yeah, I didn't have a choice, narrator! As the force of her blows overwhelms your body, the blade falls from your trembling hands, battering <laughs> uselessly to the cobblestones below. She's in chains. I Why did you lose? Um, to finish the job. So, basically, she is an absolute unit. Uh, it's like... They made her too overpowered. <laughs> so there, I think there is a possible... Like, most of the endings to this game, you're going to die. And that's kind of, like, the point of the game. Uh, but Princess soon we'll see kind of, like... We'll kind of round it out. Stands to face you. She places a confident heel on your chest and pushes you to the ground. Oh, no. This is turning into one of the, um... What is that? That, that book? Uh... The one... Very. She's the best, lol. <laughs> she's really tough. I mean, I've got to hand it to her. Her knee slides to your throat. Some of the endings we've got is horrifying. I mean, I don't want to spoil anything for you. Possibly possess. But there are some. She's badass. She will do just about anything to get out of here. Her knee slides to your throat, and your windpipe is crushed under weight. You didn't think. Pathetic. This is the end, isn't it? Yeah, it's the end. So I don't know what Everything voice we're going to get. I, I haven't done this route yet. Uh, as we go along, roots get locked off as we've done them. Uh, so we just died. You're on a path in the woods. And at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Uh, I've seen the whole game. Uh, anything. Oh, you get the tower. Okay. <laughs> oh, the tower. That sounds like she's going to be a horrifying building. Uh, so basically, um, oh, and I'm sorry, uh, Starfall, I, I didn't want to spoil the game for, uh, Sun God. I don't, uh, I don't think they've seen this one. So, um, basically, when we die, we kind of reset, and you get, like, there's, like, two chapters... I guess per run except they all kind of keep track I guess there's a total of five that we need to do uh, I know everything I need to know about this game that's impressive you know I didn't know this game my sister told me about this game when You're we first started playing it her. if you don't it will be the end of the world Uh, I'm getting a terrible sense of deja vu. He doesn't believe us. The narrator doesn't seem to follow us through as time goes on, but our voices in our head do. 
uh, as well as the princess. She will remember us. Uh, so I'll go ahead and click some of these so you can get some lore. Dead. And to answer your second question, you're here to stay the princess. I literally told you that a second ago. If he doesn't remember what happened, then maybe it's best to keep it that way. <laughs> you have the wiki open. That is totally fair. You know I can hear you, right? It's going to be a lot harder than you think to keep secrets from me. I think he's screwing with me, though. Uh, I think he does remember. I think he's just kind of messing with us. Oh, we got the broken again. To stop her. She's just going to kill us again. She is not going to kill you unless you let her. But slaying the princess and saving the world is going to be much more difficult than it has to be if you spend the whole time second-guessing yourself. Whatever, narrator. Uh, let's assume I'm telling the truth and we really did all this happen. Why should I listen to you? The narrator is an absolute dickhead, by the way. Uh, so we're just going to keep going to the cabin. A warning before you go any further. Uh. Uh, I'm not trying... <laughs> sorry, I'm, I'm trying to catch up with the chat. Uh, sorry for spoiling it then. Uh, the narrator doesn't remember. Read that part. Uh, I try not to read what you, we say. Oh. Uh, actually, Sun God, there's a way for you to... Not the broken. Don't like the broken. I think we've gotten the broken before on the route that I ran and I turned around and left. Uh, see, the rest, all you do is go for the playlist. Uh, in this channel? Yeah. Uh, yes, we, we, uh, all the other videos have actually been, uh, just uploads. Uh, so they're, they're, like, available and they are somewhat edited. Mr. Turner, I don't think I can get the Fury again. She will lie, she will cheat she will do everything in her power to stop you from slaying her. Don't believe a word she says. We might as well just pledge ourselves to her and stop pretending we're capable of doing anything in this situation. She probably doesn't even need to try to overpower us. That's true. Let me tone down the pessimism just a smidge. I'm not being a pessimist. I'm just being realistic. I'm starting to get a simp vibe You're off this guy realistic. a little bit more than broken. Uh, I'm taking the blade. Okay, is that the blade? Is that the one we want? Okay, good. <laughs> I, I guess, I guess I haven't had a chance to hear the response yet, so I'm just saying to say good. Don't pledge yourself to her. I cannot stress enough how absolutely catastrophic that would be for everyone, yourself included. I agree. If she's wrongfully imprisoned, then we should rescue her, but if he's telling the truth, we shouldn't just hand her the world on a silver platter. Rescue her? Given the stakes of the situation, there isn't really a difference between rescuing her and pledging yourself to her. Either would be terrible. So please, try to ignore both of those knuckleheads and focus on saving the world. Never. Let's the broken is a simp. Okay, excellent. I got that vibe. That's I was getting that mean. vibe. I guess I don't have a say here. So, I, but yes, I'm pretty sure we cannot get the fury again. Unless there's an alternate route here. Uh, I don't know if it has multiple per ending. The interior oh. of the cabin is larger and more grandiose than its humble exterior. Jesus. The only furniture of note is a massive marble altar with a pristine blade perched on its edge. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. Why do we feel so small? Oh no. We don't feel small. The voice of the broken is a simp and the building is really big. Do you know what he does to you?
Uh, the broken sounds like an emo. Kind of. Yeah, I get that feeling as well. A simp emo. Yeah, kind of. The broken is a simp emo. You are small. Uh, I'm... You guys also mentioned something about the tower. Um, he didn't say anything. He doesn't see the mirror for some reason. And that is associated with whatever... You walk up to the wall next to the basement. ...is going on at the end. There isn't much to see here. Oh, shoot. I just sent out a lot of... Sorry, everyone. Uh, let's just drop you guys some bombs. I uh, clicked off the screen. The blade is your implement. What are you talking about? This isn't a wall. It's a mirror. <laughs> or at least it'll be a mirror once we wipe off that layer of grime. You reach forward and rub your hand against... Oh, yeah, we're also a horrifying bird man. Ridiculous you look right now. <laughs> so... That's important information, I think. It's important to me because birds are assholes. Lucky. Except for grackles. Are better left unseen. Uh, you wipe your hand across the wall. Uh, you won five. Nice. I love us being a bird. <laughs> I like. You know, I like the idea that right now what's going on is I have a bunch of voices in my head. Uh, explore. I'm going to take the blade. Take the blade from the altar. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. Enter the basement. The door to the basement creaks open. Oh, I love this aesthetic, staircase. though. The, the castle vibe. You are tall. The smell of incense drifts up from below. Blade, no blade. It's all the same in the end. You almost feel at ease. Awesome. I almost feel at ease, really. Huh. This is actually kind of nice. It's still a stone basement. If the princess lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Her booming voice rolls oh. up the stairs. Her booming. Oh. <laughs> her booming voice rolls up the stairs. Excellent. <laughs> Is that a guest I hear? Oh no, the I don't like this. Come down and witness me. Okay, she's either going to be giant, like like really tall, big, or she's going to be like a massive bloated monster. You weren't kidding when you said it was booming. She wasn't like this last time. She never is. She wants us to see her. We need to see oh you, you fucking simp you Should are a simp worried about your sudden change in attitude just a few minutes ago you were going yes about how pointless everything was bro is the narrator in his head i really hate the broken uh he is so creepy honestly like he's like oh I, we we can't beat him but this it's all just a ploy to get down there to her um so yes, the narrator seems to only be, I can only be, uh, I'm only the one who can hear the voice of the hero, the broken and the narrator. So as far as the princess is concerned, I think she can only hear me whenever I respond. It doesn't matter what that little voice says. He's not the one making the decisions. Though if his ramblings get you to the princess, they get you to the princess. Um, ow. So, but yes, um, the narrator does have some influence over the world, though, as he seems to be able to do things. Continue down the stairs. Making your way down the spiral staircase uh, is a time. Do you know what the broken effort. does to you? What? Every step requiring you to clamber over one edge. I don't know what the narrator. What does it do to us? But soon the end comes into view, and you tumble to the bottom, uh, entering the vast temple. Oh, hello, Sean Robinson. Uh, I I did not see you join. Welcome. Uh, explore. Can I borrow some of your money? Uh, the MC might have mental problems. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Unless you're talking about me, in which case, double absolutely. Uh, do the opposite of what he says, and you will find out. What do you mean? The f do the opposite of what the... The broken says? 
the princess tower. Oh, okay. Yeah, she was ta Oh. Starlight. You know, I'm but starting to get I'm starting to get your your whole thing window. broken. Her long hair billows around her and a chain binds her wrist to the far wall. The chain is nothing to her. It might as well be a toy for all the good it would do. I told you it was pointless to resist her. <laughs> okay. The little bird has returned to me. Don't you, you dare call me a bird. You brought that knife again, even though you know it's useless. Such charming audacity. Oh god, I hate this. Drop it. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! I, I'm I'm very tempted to do what she says. I might be a simp. Uh, you do not remember what the broken does to you with the blade. Oh uh, no, no, you troll! Not not you, <laughs> lol. Sorry. Uh, yes, please don't listen to the broken. I hate the broken. But if you don't listen to him, bad things will happen. Tighten your grip. Voice acting, though. Uh, tighten As my grip. Command, the blade slips from your grasp. What the? It clatters uselessly to the floor. Oh, I pretty sh didn't I click it? Did I click the wrong one? But we didn't drop it. Oh. We decided to grip it tighter. Remember? Okay. Are you really just gonna let that happen to us? I have a duty to report facts as facts, and the fact is that you dropped the blade. Except whenever it benefits you, you son of, of a bitch. She dropped it. She's so much more than us. Is this motherfucker messing with me? What it feels like to be in her presence. Can he control me too? <laughs> gets pranked. Okay. Uh, well, shit. Oh, I understand what's going on, and you'd better snap yourself out of it. <laughs> Do you know? I don't know. Neil. Motherfucker. <laughs> oh, are you still trying to defy me? I said Neil. Your legs. Oh, my God. And your knees hit the floor. You know, but that's the facts. Whenever you find a powerful loved one, that's, the, you know. It happens. You, you sometimes you just can't control yourself. Yes, the voice can be in control sometimes, I think. Narrator might be God. I have <laughs> I have not I have plans to kill the narrator. That's my good little bird. No. Why don't we talk? Are you fucking with me? Are you is this because I did that whole thing where I was like, "Oh, yeah, I'm not going to kill you." And then killed you. Are you mad? The last That's me. Time you, met, you told me I was destined to end the world. That thought wrapped itself around my heart. It has pulled at me since the moment I squeezed the life out of your broken lungs. Oh no! I sent her down this path. I could feel its fundamental truth awaken me. The collapse of the old is a necessary prelude to the birth of the new. And the world as it is now is overdue <laughs> for alterations. What? <laughs> oh, no. Uh, she is mad at you, you little yeah bird. Oh, yes. We are like some kind of horrifying bird monster. Got pranked a second time. Uh, she's mad at you. Oh, yeah, she is. Uh, we are a bird. Uh, yeah, so as far as I can tell, we're some kind of weird bird man. Uh, we never actually get to see our face, but we can see our bird-like hand. Slay the princess. Okay, I'm gonna slay her. Don't you guys worry about that. I'm gonna get her. It's time for me to seize my destiny. And you, little bird, will help me seize it. Okay. That gives away the game, doesn't it? Oh. It certainly does. And beyond that, it more than lends credence to our conversation in the woods. I don't love the thought that in some other reality you failed to destroy her, but what's done is done. I can only hope it helped you learn a valuable lesson. Oh, it never does, narrator! You are the only one who can deal with her. And if you don't... Well, she's let you know what will happen, hasn't she? Then you shouldn't have trusted us with her destruction. <laughs> you little she bastard. 
Can't you feel it? You little shit. I missed the contrarian. He was great. He's being melodramatic, but he's not exactly wrong, is he? Everything about the contrarian. To to stop her? Uh, Slay the Princess, okay. Have you guys seen Rick and Morty? We have. Well, I don't know if I can't answer for the rest. I'm sorry. I sometimes, whenever I talk, I use the word we when I mean me. And I do not have multiple personalities. I'm not insane like the hero of this game, at least to my knowledge. Uh, you guys know Bird Guy? Uh, Bird. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bird, Bird, Bird Man. Thing. Okay. Bird Guy, Bird first Man. First, you're going to have to stuff those pessimistic thoughts someplace far, far away and commit yourself to what needs to be done. The stakes of the situation should be perfectly clear to everyone now. If you're going to save the world, you have to have faith that you can pull this off. You can't win a battle that you've already lost in your mind. Okay. Well, the Broken is not going to let this happen. <laughs> uh, what would you have me do? What is... What, what do you have planned? Uh, just because you're supposed to end the world doesn't mean you actually have to do it. You can uh, be whatever you want to be. Uh, I have a question for you before I decide to do anything. What happened to you after I died? Uh, I'm not going to help you in the world. I don't care if something new comes after. I just can't let you do that. I'm yours to command. Pledge yourself to her. I must. Um. I have a question for you before I decide anything. Know the limits of your privilege, little bird. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I think she does not care about if you talk or not. I, I'm getting the opposite impression now. There is an empty place at my side for you to fill, if you'll have it. But it is not a place for an equal. It is a place for something worthy to be kept. A priest, perhaps. Or a pet. Um, I'm going to go ahead and interject the first thing I thought here. Just now. Uh, has anyone here seen the movie The Muppets, uh, whatever. The second one or something like that. I think she does not. Oh, I've already read that. Uh, but the one that has the song, uh, I'm number one, you're number two. Uh, I'm getting heavy vibes here from that. <laughs> uh, what would you have d have me do? What, what do you have planned? All you have to do is break these chains and set me free. Okay. Uh, if you're so powerful, can't you just break them but change yourself? Yeah, you know, you're starting to see... Oh. The Broken. Uh, what Muppet movie? Nah. Slay her, please. <laughs> oh. <laughs> don't worry, I'll slay her. Um... There, uh, I don't remember. It was like Most Wanted or something like that. It was one of the newer ones. That's exactly why it's rude. We should know our place. Do not listen to the broken. Slay the princess. <laughs> I can't. I just say the broken's me. making a but lot of sense here. To do. The story of a terrible and bountiful god unbounded of her own will is no story at all. It's not worthy of everything I am. For everything I'm bound to become. You're bound to become a corpse. Of what I was. Oh, please, please the let that be a choice. The genesis that's to follow in my wake is deserving of a song that can echo for eternity. Oh, you're going to sing to the me? The song of you being so struck by my glory, so overwhelmed by what I am. That you uh, please. Feel you must deliver me into the world. Okay. Uh, please slay her. I know I like her, but don't listen to the broken. You hate the broken more than you like the princess. That's fair. 
Uh, can you make her fall for you? Um, I've tried in the past. Uh, exactly what he says. Do not listen to the broken. He's not good. To you uh, good. You do not want to see what he does at the end. Yes, maybe kind of, sort of like that. Uh, yes, in other endings. Yes, um, I've I've tried. I've not. I don't think I've actually gotten any endings where she falls. Oh yes, we did. We got one ending where she fell for me. And, from your act of utter and it was upsetting. Springs a new dawn, a better dawn. Submit now. Submit later. It makes no difference because in the end, no matter how vainly you struggle against me. My will triumphs over yours. You know what? I'm yours. I say. Oh, <laughs> that's it, huh? Perhaps you. Oh, need the music stopped. The music stopped. I'm yours. fucked. Pick up that needle. I. It's a little bit more than a needle, dude. Do it. Uh, which one was that again? Also, the music is bars. Uh, yes, and the other ending. Uh, no, Mr. Turtle. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. We're going to stab her to death. Um. I had a brain fart here. <laughs> I can't remember what I was doing. No objections here. Oh, the one that we ended with. Um, that was the one where we tried to save her and uh, Mr. Narrator decided that uh, that wasn't going to happen and took control of me. And uh, then she fell in love with me and I felt really bad because I broke her. Uh, I think that was like the third ending. Uh, oh, yeah, the stranger. Was that the stranger? I no, it was the damsel. We got the damsel. I don't know what she's planning, and I don't like that we don't know what she's planning, but we might as well pick up the blade. Uh it's the one uh the it wasn't the one I wouldn't say bad looking, it's the one where she reverted down to like a sketch. Uh she turns into like a sketch version of herself. You feel a some divine hand that sits unperceived by your senses, but that manages to push you towards its desires like an unseen puppeteer. Oh. All right, so this is the only ending Reach we can get now. And grasp the blade. The grayed out options can't be followed because we've already done them. Stand. Or we would get the same ending we've already gotten. This one's easy. See? This isn't so bad. Wait, we're doing what the broken wants, so. Uh, Mr. Turtle, be prepared of what's going to happen to you. Oh. Why did you do this? I'm sorry! I didn't... I, I thought... <laughs> I thought okay, I was getting yeah. something we can do that. better. I thought it was going to be, like, clever. Oh, I can't resist her. Creaking tension between body and will as you slowly rise to your feet. I'm so sorry. Foes forced into an unhappy truce. I didn't mean to go with him. Uh, take that blade. The princess okay. carries you with soft contemplation. The moment seems to last a lifetime. The silent anticipation of what's to come dragging out the <gasps> long, painful Oh my god, what if she, instead of killing me, she just gives me a little peck on the open. cheek. A kiss. A sweet, loving kiss. To defy me is to claim we stand on level ground. We do. We do not. Oh, you of course. You quiet shadow, while I am brilliant radiance. Okay, you kind of got a big head, Take dude. A knife in your hand and slit your throat. Oh. What? What? <laughs> you don't have to listen to her. You're armed. Just steal your nerves, step forward, and end this. 
You son of a bitch! It won't let me do anything else. This is gonna be where I slit my own throat. Oh. Take the blade, slay the princess. Oh no, this isn't good for you. Uh, broken right now. So why do good girls like bad guys? <laughs> so true. I'm sorry, I definitely picked something wrong at some point. Oh, we'll end this all right. Broken, get... Like for hand lifts the blade and brings it towards. Oh, okay, maybe I'll be able to gain control again. The unclear language. End her. Oh, oh, oh! Slay myself! Yeah. Your body is sluggish and unresponsive, actively fighting against you, but you do your best to stagger forward. One step at a time, you move towards the princess. Uh. The hero can help us, right? I'm sure the hero voice will. I haven't heard him talking a bit, your throat, or I don't. I didn't recognize it. it. But it seems you're in need of a harsher lesson. Listen, I'll do whatever you Why say for a kiss on the cheek. Oh. Sorry. Why are you sorry? Uh, the hero can't help us. by the cartel. Don't As you take You son forward, of a bitch, you didn't give me a choice. Slicing through flesh with ease. It somehow feels like an entirely natural thing to do while the simple act of walking has become an arduous impossibility. Then it slides back out, the wound burning as a small hiss of air escapes through the fresh Oh orifice. no, there was a snake in my lungs. Now, do it again. Keep doing it until I give you permission to stop. Those are just words. You don't have to listen to her. It's what she wants. Broken! Fuck off! You, heroic one, what are you doing? Don't just let this happen. Stop him from killing you. I'm on it. <laughs> I'm on it! <laughs> Your other hand locks around Oh my god, they each have control of a hand? ...vital organs. Blade still flails towards Oh my god. Slice bits of skin that no. To to join uh, this is what happens to you. you. Mr. Turtle, like I tried to warn to keep you about piece, the broken. At least for now. By default, use yourself. Oh. Okay, uh, is there anything I could do? Display. A wounded little bird. They can, they can defy a god. It doesn't have to be like this. It doesn't have to hurt so much. You can choose a gentle end. You can choose to leave that punctured vessel for the next. Oh, it's still gonna let me slay the princess. Let's do it. Or oh. you can pathetically struggle By default, yourself use yourself. Personality disorder. Oh yeah, this guy's definitely got that. You continue to approach the princess, even as the repeated gouges of your blade expose bone and muscle to the oh god. I really didn't expect an ending where I had to fight myself. You know, this would be a lot easier if you gave us a hand. My influence only goes so far, and I can only juggle so many things at once. No, you can fucking do whatever the hell you want. I know. Forward. Believe me, this whole ordeal would be so much easier if I didn't have to contend with free will. <laughs> Bro, what's happening? Uh, death is what's happening. Why the noises? Uh, that is the sound of me stabbing myself over and over again, unless you guys are hearing something else that I don't hear. You're the one making things difficult. You're the one making us hurt. She doesn't want to hurt us. She's just doing what she has to. Stop. Okay. As you finish crossing the room, oh, no. you fall to your knees at the princess's feet, your chest heaving as your blood pools in the crevices of the stone floor, the coppery taste coating your throat. 
I'm back. What happened? Did you have to get out of here before I came into the broken? <laughs> uh, I'm still resisting her. Um, I'm stabbing myself and walking towards her. The broken definitely wants us to kill ourselves, though. The princess kneels down, lifting your chin with her finger as her face lowers to yours. Oh my god, is this the kiss? Was she proud of how much? You've surrendered to delusion. But something about your defiant spirit <gasps> speaks to me. She loved it. You are different than you were before. Perhaps, if you've learned your lesson, I can spare you from the release of death. No, I've I've already seen it. You've seen you've gotten a flicker of my rebellion. Demeaning, and, isn't it? And now you want to Yes, how far you want me to fight you back. It's a mercy. Take it. I think he's given up whatever say he had at the start of all this. At least one of you is sane. She's within striking distance. She's no, the fact Don't that I'm hearing voices now, kind of implies none of us are. You have what it takes to put an end to her. Seize the moment before it's too late. I'm yours, princess. Kiss me. <laughs> Let's make normal sized babies. Wait, would that be a normal? No, I'm not small. I'm normal sized. By one of my many eyes. You cannot walk it again. Change your course. What? Wait, what? What? I think she's fucking with me because she knows that I know that the things are knowing. Uh, that I know I can't follow one. I said no. I think she it's is like to resist. actually yeah. developing godly Everything powers. To oblivion. I didn't play Oblivion. Sorry. I know it was supposed to be really good, but I didn't play it. But you're not the one resisting me, are you? There's something else in there. It's the voice of the broken. You should take it. Is that a person? No, it used to be a person. It's something different now. Huh? An echo. The broken, I think? Uh, she found the narrator. Oh my god! Are you gonna kill the narrator? I will 100% submit if you is, kill him. Is she talking about you? That's impossible. She's not supposed to be able to interact with me. She. You're a small one, aren't you? Oh my god! A shriveling little worm stretched beyond its limits, trying to control things that it can't understand. Say goodbye, narr goodbye, narrator. Fuck you, dude. No, no, no. What are you talking about? I'm just. Oh, it's a little bit more scary when you're on the receiving end of a giant. Oh yes. Goodbye, narrator. <laughs> you bring the blade to your neck. You slice through soft. Oh my God! She took over the narrator. Your blood flowing freely down your body. It's a painful lesson in obedience, but the pain won't last forever. No, oh my god. No, 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 no. When I see you again, you'll free me from my chains and deliver me to the destiny that lies beyond this place. Okay. We will. Oh my god, are we gonna get an ending where she's just the narrator? I know you will. Okay. Everything goes dark. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, uh, so sad, but at least we didn't hear the broken a lot now. Uh, not gonna lie, I'm getting cooked. Uh, yes. The narrator's a dick and I hate him. Uh, make sure you tell the third narrator what happened to him. Oh! Oh, that's kind of sad. He's gonna be there. Apotheosis? You're on a path. Oh my place. god! And at the end of that path... Oh, let me guess. At the end of that path is a cabin. Excuse me? This is the third time we've been here, and this is... Oh, paranoid. It's, it's all big and weird. 
uh, make sure to tell the third narrator what happens to him. Dang, I don't remember this one. Uh, this one, she's a literal god. Oh no, how do we fight a god? Another witness to her radiance. Oh, her get out of here. Is soon upon us. I'm here to keep him in check. I'm sick of prying fingers digging around in our head, and he's making it all too easy for them to get in. This is bad. <laughs> we have so many voices. My favorite part of the voices is that they're all just the oh, same voice yeah. actor. I hadn't noticed. Do you need a primer, Mr. Amnesiac? OMG Paranoia, I love this voice. I, I, I'm liking him right now. He's he's after the broken. No, I'm quite all right, but if all of you would take a moment to settle down, there's something important I'd like to get across to you before it's too late. Is it about the princess? We already know all about the princess. I like how the hero has turned quite sar sarcastic. Did that one? No. I mean, yes, it's about the princess, but whatever you think I'm going to say, it's probably not that. You're not to be trusted either. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm on board, paranoid. Fine, just out with her already, yeah? But if I hear the words, you're here to slay her, or if you don't, it will be the end of the world, you'll have lost speaking privileges. <laughs> um, let's see... Get as much information as you can because it's interesting. Okay. Uh, he's not like the broken. He's he's not like the broken. Yeah, I mean, he's the opposite. It feels like. Hey, White Shark. Welcome to the stream. We are playing Slay the Princess. Uh, why, hi. <laughs> How are you this fine evening? Uh, welcome to the stream. All that good jazz. We got We got some new little avatar guys running around. That you guys can play around with. Uh, we've lost. He's lost it. Time. Okay. It's all going to end when we open that cabin door, which means it's already all over. What's the point of dawdling when the end is already written? Oh, fuck okay, off, broken. That nonsense he's going on about. That's what we need to talk about. You've been here before, obviously. So you have met us. Because, boy, were you in denial about that last time. Yeah. No, I haven't met you, but reality is clearly falling apart at the moment, and the only reason that would happen is if you knew things you weren't supposed to know. That's true. We do know stuff. Uh, Hi, White Shark. Hola. Broken is too broken. He, it really is. He's got, like, that weird uh, cultist mentality. Uh, can you give White Shark an avatar? Um, White Shark should have an avatar. Everyone should get one when they join the chat. Let me just check here. Um, yeah, White Shark, it looks like they just kind of fell behind some people. Or uh, moved behind some people. Uh, there's also a bunch of commands you guys can try. I don't remember what any of them are. He got one. Okay, good. <laughs> what? What the hell are you talking about? He's talking about those weird marble trees and how wrong everything looks. Oh, they are marble. Yes, exactly. Whatever you did before gave her far too much power. So you've got to cut it out, get to that cabin and slay her before things get any more out of hand. Ah, sorry, I needed to take a drink of this. Oh, God, that is just like the nastiest water. Ugh. Uh, yes, exactly. When you blah, blah, get it out of hand. Okay. Uh, what is one of the commands then? Uh, it will be exclamation mark jump is the only one I know of. Weird thought. Why do I want to eat the marble? Do you want to eat the marble? I don't know. This the marble doesn't look edible to me, but that's that's weird for me as well. Weird thought. Yeah, I, I guess so. Uh, the water was found in the sewer. Very likely, it is um, Gatorade water. I bought it because I thought, oh, maybe it's got like a mild Gatorade flavor that might be good. No, it's just like bottled tap water. I just broke any chances of me getting Gatorade partners. It's sponsored by Gatorade. 
Uh, yeah, I want to eat the marble. Hello? That's fair. Uh, the narrator is basically going to give you information you do not even know. Okay. Oh, did it not work? Uh, you should have jumped with that. I'll have to look into it. I might have messed up the command stuff, so I'll have to look into that after we get done here. We've built a new god. Oh, eat shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit. What if I'm doing it wrong? What if I'm making her even stronger? Oh my god, I love this voice. Almost as much as the contrarian. This is now my second favorite voice. I'm only giving you the sliver of information I'm giving you now because things are already deep in the shitter. This was my last card to play and it looks like it's already made things worse. So hurry, cabin, now. Uh, jump, jump. Is there a run? I don't think there's a run. Um, there might be a right or something. Uh, maybe. Uh, my avatar just now jumped, by the way. Oh, good, good, good. Uh, the paranoid is my favorite one. The paranoid does seem pretty good. <laughs> it seems like a fun voice. Okay. Uh, so we want to get information. Okay. Now, hold on. I have so many questions. Right now, you have neither the time nor the mental acuity to handle a single response. It's now or never. This is a response. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to the cabin until I have answers. As you finish what am your I? Name question, the ground quakes beneath your feet. Oh, shit. You feel an unyielding force pulling at you and your surroundings. The trees start to sway and then crumble, breaking apart as everything is drawn towards the cabin. Wow, okay. Um, basically, the every chapter of what you perceive her to be, she will be, if it, it in the next one, and the next one after that. Hi there. Hey, Cryo. Welcome to the chat and stream, all that good stuff. Uh, we now have a little bit of a, a, a fun time going on here. Uh, you guys have little avatars that you guys can uh, play around with as well as a few different uh, deals. Uh, hi, Cryo. Hi. Uh, here she comes, the big one. Oh, God, is she coming for me? Can you have a Delulu voice? I'm not sure what Delulu is, but maybe? <laughs> uh, oh, now I remember that this, she's big. Oh, hello, Cryo. Delusional. Um, I would argue that the fucking broken is a little delusional. Um, we also, there's the smitten voice, which is... <laughs> he's awesome. I would say he is at that moment my third favorite. He, it's like the narrator's trying to do like a, uh... A, the voice of, uh, Matt Barry. And I love it. Even the earth beneath you seems to shift. Your feet unable to grip solid ground as you're dragged forward along with everything else. Oh, God. The end of everything. The beginning of something new. The moment we open Oh, the door, is she gonna be like, she will be big, broken. big? Stop believing everything you hear. You oh, man, we're gonna be playing Colossus here in a minute. To think straight. Any, uh, words of warning? You already know everything you need to know. <laughs> okay. Step forward. Oh God. Oh my God. Oh, this music is intense. Holy shit. You watch in paralyzed awe and terror as the princess emerges. Oh my god! Space as she stands upright to face you. Oh! I may be in love with a new god! Wow, okay. Uh, chat, sorry, sorry. 
Uh, let's see. Big, big cabin will explode. Cryo delusional. Okay. Uh, there's nothing you can do. You can do whatever you want. Uh, big, big cabin will explode. Oh, in the mountain. Yep. Uh, narrator. Uh, for some reason, after the ground shakes so hard, the protagonist is still calm because the computer guy's talking up. Take a break. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> How big are you thinking? Pretty. I wasn't thinking this big. Uh, AOT. Uh, I hope you're reading chat. Uh, no, that's the final boss for real. <laughs> uh, she is God. Lovely. Founding Titan <laughs> reference. <laughs> I'm I'm excited for this one. The ruined landscape shifts. Trees and stone and the ground itself succumbing to her gravity, orbiting her like a great black hole. Finally, the little bird has set me free. This is always how it was going to end, and this is always how it was going to begin. Oh! <laughs> As if I'm gonna kill her! I'm gonna kill her! Screw all of this, I'm with you. A rig will never make it. And even if you do, what could you possibly hope to accomplish? Uh, who would win? God, Princess, or Godzilla? Uh, it's basically coughing baby versus hydrogen bomb. I'm a little bit more than a coughing baby. I'm at least a toddler. Do not pick up the blade. It's useless to you. I pick up the blade. We'll do what we're always supposed to. We'll take this blade and we'll sink it into her heart. Look at the way everything's being flung around her. If we just blow ourselves in her direction. Okay, I'm going to turn down the, the music just a tad. It's it's really cool. I'm loving this this atmosphere, but I'm not hearing the uh, the voices. <laughs> um, I was going to say not to do it, but Broken said not to do. So pick it up. Okay. Uh, yo, a toddler playing a game. OMG, <laughs> lol. Uh, the music is so loud, but so good. Yes, um... I'm not sure if we're caught up to that point, but I, d I have- I've lowered it a little bit. For real. <laughs> um... The soundtrack goes hard. It does, it does. So, okay, so hopefully if this- I'll, I'll wait here for just a second and let you guys- is, is this volume a bit better? A little bit. It really goes hard. <laughs> Insert OST. I did not see you. That's good. Okay, perfect. All right, let's continue. With a forceful tug, you yank the blade out from the tree. You close your eyes. Breath, that was my breath. You can feel everything around you, like you're a part of everything. Oh my god, this is such an anime deal right now. And then your eyes open, settling on your target. Oh shit. Slay the princess. You launch yourself towards the princess. You can feel her gravity <laughs> envelop, carrying you from the ground into the violent swirl of her orbit. Uh, that's good. Oh, so high, Cryo. Uh, I did not see you. Uh, point of view when you go to the final stage and the music. <laughs> yeah. Uh, jump, jump. Is this part canon to your paths? Jump. Uh, the she eats you. <laughs> yeah. I'm kind of expecting to like get swatted or squashed like a fly or just go. 
just uh, attack on Titan style. Like, don't worry, I'm gonna kill the Titan. Gone. Even now, you oh, her face is so much prettier now. End this. Why do I feel so cold? Oh. Oh, I kind of forgot. Um, I may have to deal with an issue. Um, I think we're about to get caught cheating. <laughs> Bad ending. You dead. Smash your pass. Oh, yeah. You know what? Maybe we'll do a Smash or Pass Princess edition. <laughs> uh, the main princess is back, aka the hands. Oh, yeah. Huh? Uh, here comes the crabby hands. No cheating. Um, yeah, I think we're going to have to go deal with my true love. Oh, my God. That was such a cool one. You do not get the chance to slay her, nor will you ever. It's time to leave. Memory returns. Oh, where did she go? She's gone. Is this the end of the world? Did she end herself? And there's that mirror again. Why is it here? Why now? So, for those of you who are not familiar with the story... Uh, smash. <laughs> You're not cheating. It's the only cheating if you wanted to kill her, but you killed yourself. Oh, okay. Uh, make the broken shut up, please. <laughs> Don't worry, I am absolutely going to make him. She was the dead all along. She was the dad. Um, so, for those of you who are not familiar, this part of the game is at the end of every run, um, like, sometimes it's the second, and usually it's the third, a big bundle of hands comes out and takes the princess. Uh, and then we end up in this void where we meet with my true love. Approach the mirror. I'm sorry, paranoid. I just, I can't deal with the broken right now. This, this doesn't feel right. It feels different. Final. It's calling us. And not in a good way. Don't worry, paranoid. I don't want to look at us. Oh, where are you gonna look? The voices feel small, distant as you approach. Gaze into the reflection. And that's my bird arm. Silence as you reach forward. They're gone, once again. The mirror always makes them leave, but you need to see what's in it. Ooh. You've unraveled. You find yourself in the long quiet once again. Uh, oh. Uh, make the broken shut up. Read that. So was the dad all along. No. <laughs> Are you ha uh, reading chat? Yes, I am. <laughs> uh, who? Uh, I like to call her the main princess or hands. Uh, I just call her my loved one, my my true love. Uh, how many endings are there? I think somebody said there were eight or were there 12? I don't remember. Uh, somebody earlier mentioned it in the chat. Smash or pass the mirror. Um, smash. Then glass. Pass. Uh, who's your love? Uh, my love is actually, we're about to see her. So, um, she is basically the one I'm killing princesses for. Uh, at the most, there are 12 princesses that you can get, but for endings, there are a couple of them. Smash. <laughs> so, uh, we're about to meet her again. Basically, each time we come here, she's collecting, uh, princesses, basically. Oh my god. She's ahead this time. Approach her. There's a world beyond the endless walls of the long quiet. I am curious to see what it means for us to know it. Oh my god. So, 
uh, from I'm still not entirely sure what she is. She's some kind of deity, and she doesn't have like her own being. So every time we go through a route and collect a princess, we take the vessel to her. And she gets, I guess, after a certain amount of princesses, she becomes complete. And uh, I'm hoping I get a kiss at the end. Uh, you're going to meet her again. Uh, messed up. She's too big. You cannot see her hands. Meet? Oh, well, yeah, I guess you could look at it as meat. Uh, I don't know. I hope that this isn't, like, her final form. Because I don't know if I can, like, kiss this. Uh, do you think there are people out there? Whoa, that's an interesting question. Do you think that anything is real out there? Do you think that we're real? Do you have thoughts on the vessel? Uh, do you know what's going to happen when you awaken? When you send me back, I'm not alone. There are voices that speak. Oh my god, it's let me ask you about the voices now. Uh, there are voices that speak to me. Some of them are me, but one of them is something else. I call him the narrator. Uh, and he wants me to kill you. Do you have a narrator? Have the vessels had one? Oh my god, there's so much information now. Uh, how many more vessels do I need to bring you? I'm ready to go back. Okay, not that. Uh, let's go. Let's explore our options here. Uh, let me read chat before we do that. Uh, why are we questioning ourselves right now? Oh. Uh, not just a kiss, but a smash. <laughs> Too big. I, I, I'm gonna. I'm gonna wait for her to maybe be smaller. Smash the 100 foot woman. That is someone is into that. I'm telling I I I'm telling you someone's into that. Uh why are we questioning ourselves right now? <laughs> I don't think you could smash her even if you wanted to. Uh you would get crushed and suffocated. Worth it. That is absolutely I I I got to say that's somebody's that's somebody's fantasy. Uh do you think there are people out there? It doesn't matter if there are People are frail and impermanent. You and I are the only things that interest me. Aww. She's not mad that I fell in love with another god. Do you think that there's anything real out there? Do you think that we're real? We are real. Nothing is an idea that dwells in the absence of something. But nothing cannot exist on its own. And because of that, nothing can't exist. I'm petting her nose. Uh, do you have thoughts on this vessel? This one is dominance. A oh. figure capable of bending everything to her will. She will make for a terrifying and divine heart. Oh my god. I'm worried that I brought her too many negative bodies. Her, for she would not be able to mourn you. Oh. Oh, how sweet. Yeah, I know. Uh, is this princess canon? Are there can are there princesses that aren't? Uh, your love loves you. Yeah, she does. I'm I'm very happy that she she seems to. Like, I'm worried that once she becomes full, she's gonna be like, yeah, this guy's messed up in the head. Uh, like with your other ones, the fourth one is this one canon. Is this a canon event? Maybe next time, don't bring the blade. By the way, what color you see? Uh, her? She's like black and white, right? Um, yeah, I assume this is canon. I, I assume this is a whole part of it. Uh, do you know what's going to happen when you awaken? No. The point of awakening is to find out. Uh, when you send me back, I have all these voices. No, their minds are empty, existent, but constantly shifting into something new. Oh. Do you think your narrator lives in the spaces beyond? I don't know. I think he lives in my head. He does. I don't know why, but I know this for a fact. He does. I don't know what I'm going to do when I find him. 
He does, and when I find him, you and I are going to going to have answers. Oh, that's me and him, her. He does, and when I find him, I'm going to kill... That honestly feels like something I've been screaming a lot. He does, but you're going to keep that to yourself. <laughs> oh man, both of these options sound really good. I think I'm just going to kill him. If he is anything other than us, he isn't worth the effort to destroy. Oh my god, this is like that moment in the movie where I'm like raging and I'm flipping tables because I can definitely do that because this is a movie and the table is like rigged to like a string. And she's like, you have to calm down. He's not worth it. And I'm like, you're right. It's just you and me, baby. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm having fantasies now. Uh, black, gray, white colors. She's black and white. By the way, what? Okay, see that one. Uh, I'm talking about your paths. Nah, I'm just trolling with this color blind issue. Uh, yeah, a lot of people love to make fun of that. The MC might have color blind or is. No, you're good. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm definitely a little color blind. I'm ready to go back. Uh, how many more vessels do you need? Oh, yeah, this is it. Next will be enough. And then gravity will pull the others back to me. I will be singular. A final multitude. Yes. If this is the last time, is there anything you would like me to bring you? These gifts are a conversation. And each one shows me the contours of your heart. The only thing I want to see is what you choose for me. Oh. Is fully drawn. Uh, if this is the last stage before your completion, then I'm not going back. I'm just going to stay. No! I'm ready to go back. The next time I see you, each of us will finally know what we are. Lovers. I will be here, waiting for you. Oh, that always scares me. Every fucking time. I know it's going to happen, too. The hero and the princess. You're on a path in the woods. And at the end of that path uh, is a cabin. All the princesses are and canon. In the basement of that cabin. I can't wait for the next princess. one. Uh, let me test. I've been saying this the whole time for out of five. Okay. Uh, no wait. Stay. There's an. Oh, is there? I'm so sorry. I didn't. I didn't wait. I'm sorry. Shit. Well, uh, I messed that up. <laughs> uh, I miss the paranoid right now. Not gonna lie. <laughs> it's fine. I'll show you next time. Okay. Um, all right. Let's do a quick You're save. To slay her. Yeah, I get it. I know. I, we, we get the reference. Let's do a quick save here. Uh, the end of the world. What are you talking about? Have you considered that maybe the only reason she's going to end the world? Uh, killing a princess seems kind of bad, though. Uh, can't someone else do this? Uh, forget it, I'm not doing it. I think these are all the same options. Silently continue. Okay, so we're trying to get the blade, correct? Or the razor blade something? <laughs> Just saw that. Imagine you press Alt F5. <laughs> Um, yeah, I need to rebind all those keys so there's no chance of that ever happening again. Uh, because it's my turn, right? Yes. Sorry, it looks like we're a little, you guys are a little bit, uh, stre streaming a little bit farther behind me than normal. Just a little bit anyway. Uh, Dino Head. Okay, yeah, we can we can do Dino Head. I think I did the wrong one. 
Was this moose? I did moose, didn't I? Sorry, I'm trying to get over here. Let's do this dino head today. Yeah, we'll be a little tricyclaratops. Tricyclaratops. Wow, wow. That, that, was, that was the dino music that played. That wasn't me saying that. <laughs> uh... Why is there so much stars? Uh, sorry, that was me. I, I kept pushing buttons. Uh, I didn't. I didn't mean to do that much. Uh, I'm getting a lot right now. Uh, then we can do dragon. Yay stars! I, I'm sorry, I missed a lot of chat. <laughs> uh, Dino head. Yay stars. Uh, then we can do dragon. Triceratops. Triceratops. Oh! <laughs> okay, I got that one. I actually got that one. Uh, I'm getting a lot right now. Uh, I uh, tried. Starfall. Tried. Okay. Uh, Alright. Oh, shit! What did I put? I hit a button. Did I stop the stream? I didn't stop the stream, did I? Okay, it looks like everything's still going from land before time. Sticky keys. Oh, okay. Not shift. Not the shift. No. Okay. Whew. I dropped my phone on my keyboard. Ah, uh, scared me. I thought maybe I just stopped everything. Uh, technical issues. All right. Um, so let's head on. Uh, I think Kenneth. I believe you are going to be leading this one. We can still see you. Excellent. Oh, yeah. She stopped it. Pearls. Uh, Perhaps. I couldn't even read that. So there we go. <laughs> Not joking. Uh, you got this, Kenneth. Good luck, Kenneth. Lead the way. Take us to our destiny. I've, I've got a backup save here, so... Uh, finally, you said my name for the first time in the stream. Wait, did I not... Have I not said your name at all this time? Blind people still can't see you. I still can't see you. Can you not see me? Are you okay? Also, I think my head tracking has stopped. Or maybe not. Anyway, I, I'm very sorry I have not said your name. I I, I forget. I, I get I get caught up in my own little ways, you know. Uh, I can see you. Thank you, Starfall. Uh, we can see you. Fine. Okay, excellent. Dreamy bull. Uh, now, which one should I do first? Uh, try to find a better place for my phone. <laughs> Crap. I've got a very small desk space. Time to spam jump. Hope you guys don't mind. Uh, just be a little careful. Don't, don't, don't trigger yourself too much. There's also a, um, a keyboard somewhere. I don't actually know how it works. Or not a keyboard, a controller console. Uh, do you want the ra uh, the razor or the din beast 
or the true ending. Uh, I will let you pick. Uh, cause most likely after we do this one, uh, we'll, well, probably not tonight, but we'll probably keep playing more on the channel and, uh, get some of the other endings as well. Yeah. Crap. Got to find a better way to do this chat. <laughs> I need a secondary monitor. Uh, lower white shark is Mario brothers. Now I can't jump. Oh, it might be an issue with the, uh, the thing, the chat taking a while. Uh, I'm just that. No, I'm going to say it's more than likely, um, <laughs> me, I'm that fat. I'm holding you down. Uh, can you read my text? Uh, oh, which one was it? Did I overlook it? Uh, lower white shark, Mario Brothers now. Uh, we should do Den Beast. Uh, do you want the Brazer or the Den Beast? Did I miss one in between or before that? Uh, I'll I'll check to see if there's a way to um, like not block it, but make it so that it doesn't appear in chat in the future. The the commands. I'll see you again. Don't worry. Do not worry. I will say it again. Okay. Yeah, you might need to. I can't find it. I'm afraid. <laughs> uh, like I said, I'll I'll see about getting rid of the uh, the pop up spam. I'm drowning in jump commands. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we might want to cool it a little bit on those, but for the future, I'll, I'll take a look at it. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't think those actually popped up when you typed them when I set all this up. So, uh, that's, that's on me. Uh, once again, I didn't really look at it. Uh, do you want the razor or the den beast or the ending where we can all do all three or the ending or we can do all three? Uh, let me check what time it is real quick. It's about 10 30. So it looks like we're only gonna have time to do one more ending. Uh, so I'll let you, or I can show you the ending and give you one of her two princesses. White shark, no, what are you doing? Um, I, I think you can pick whichever ending you feel best about. Um, AM, PM. Oh, for me, uh, it is currently about 1030 in the evening for me. Uh, it's 1035. So, uh, yeah, 11 PM for you guys, uh, or for you. Uh, yeah, it's, it's getting a bit later. I, I was only going to go to about 10 today, but like I said earlier, I get a little caught up in this stuff. So, uh, we're going to, we'll go ahead and do one more ending before before we go too, too deep into it. All right, let's get an ending first. 11.35 a.m. Very early. Because <laughs> I'm at Asia. Uh, you need to agree with the narrator killer. Okay, so just follow his, his thing. I Killing a... Uh, at the end of the world, blah, 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 blah. We've done all of this. Uh, can't someone else do this? Forget it. I'm not doing this. Uh, have you considered blah, blah, blah. Do I get some kind of reward? Okay. Thanks for telling Don't me. Mention it. It's all part of the job. 
you make your way up the short path to the cabin. You'll find the princess within. We're not going to go through with this, right? She's a princess. We're supposed to save princesses, not mm, slave. I don't know about this hero. We got to do it. Ignore him. He doesn't know what he's talking about. The narrator. I hate the narrator. He is so annoying. He's just like a dick all the time. Uh, you're at Asia 2. Welcome. Asia 2. 837. <laughs> um, I still... I, I hate that there are time zones. I wish everyone was on the same time and it was always... 3.30 in the morning for everyone. So that way we could sleep if we wanted to. The interior of the cabin is almost entirely bare. The air is stale and musty, and the floor and walls are painted in a fine layer of dust. The only furniture of note is a plain wooden table. Perched on that table is a pristine blade. Yapper of the year narrator. Yes, um, that is, I gotta say one thing me and the narrator have in common. And this is actually not true. Uh, we both love the sound of our own voice. I actually just like the sound of other people hearing my voice. I don't actually like my voice itself. Uh, do you live in Texas? I do live in Texas. Uh, wait for us to catch up so I can speak. Okay. <laughs> no worries. No worries. I'm holding off. Uh, he lives in Texas, where probably Texas Chicken invented. Texas Chicken invented? I don't think we invented the chicken. That being said, I, I know we invented um, baked beans. Is that what we did? Wait, what was our thing? <laughs> Do we have anything, KFC? Kentucky Fried Chicken. I think that was made in Kentucky. By a man in a white suit. Uh, this part, you need to take the blade and do not say anything to her on the way down. That's at Africa. KFC? The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. Right. Take the blade and say nothing. You take the blade from the table. It'd be rather difficult to slay the princess and save the world without it. Into the basement. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a staircase faintly illuminated by an unseen light in the room below. This is an oppressive place. Okay, we've heard all this. Carries up the stairs. Who's there? She sounds dangerous. It's almost as if she's the one in charge down here. Don't let it fool you. It's all part of the manipulation. Okay, I need to say. Okay, continue down the stairs. Good. You're still listening to reason. Uh, this part you need to... That's in Africa. Wait, what? Enter the gamer hideout. Wait, which one are we doing now? Africa. I don't know. I didn't even know this game. Oh, <laughs> I see. Everyone's a, everyone's a little bit confused as to what's going on. Uh, I'm not sure which one we're doing. Kenneth is actually going to be leading us through this one a little bit. Uh, so it's... it's um, uh, they they told us a few options. I think it was like the beast with eyes with the or the razor or There's maybe something else. Her wrist, binding her to the far wall of the basement. Uh, you still your resolve and Slater. She's so coldly beautiful. Is she really a threat to the world? Focus on the task at hand. Well, she is if you do listen to me. And there you are. Are you here to kill me or something? Uh, you steal your reserve. Uh, smash or pee. I mean, smash or smash. I don't know. This version of the princess, she has kind of, uh, wait, where is it? Steal your reserves. Or you steal your reserve nerves and step forward. Uh, forward, her eyes are a bit on the upsetting to me. They're too big. Your resolve. 
Uh, bro, she's so pretty. Like, I mean, it's just the oh, eyes that get me a little. Men? Fine. What even makes you think you can kill me? Uh, the fact that I'm listening to someone else. I, I do. I have a I'm lot of voices. Up in this basement for a reason, right? And if that knife is the only weapon you have, you'll have to get close enough to use it. Ooh. So, Ooh, that water's you not good. Just drop it. Best not to risk finding out what I can do. Just wait for me for further instructions. Yes, sir, or ma'am, or uh, they. I, I'm sorry. I always assume gender, and I shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> Awaiting further instructions, Commander. Uh, the thing about the princess is she's great and all. I've made her fall in love with me in the past, but you know, it always ends in one thing. I always return to my one true love. Uh, dang. Uh, wait for me when you get to the word part. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> She's unarmed. If you hesitate now, it'll be too late. End the... There we go. Uh, but the princess is your true love. Don't worry, princess. Uh, yeah, but you know, I like to think of myself as a, uh, a dashing, a dashing, uh, not dashing, I'm not dashing at all, a devilish charmer who carries a blade around and, and I, when I talk to the princess, I, I slide the blade across her face and say things like, oh, you're so pretty, uh, that's a psychopath, I just described a psychopath, that's great, <laughs> I wasn't trying to describe a psychopath. Uh, you said in complete silence when you said your true love. Oh, slay her. This one you have to press play, play the princess. Uh, no, we are slaying her. Yes, Starfall. We have to get this ending. All right. Slay the princess. You lunge forward without a moment. Oh, hesitation. this one actually feels bad now. She's actually like startled. You feel flesh easily give way and look down to see your blade already sinking deep into her heart. Oh. No one expects the blade. This is it, isn't it? I'm sorry. I'm almost embarrassed. I should have seen that coming. But I have to wonder, do you actually believe this was enough to kill me? I feel like we've gotten this before. So she's convinced she can't die. Yes, even as she lays there dying, she entirely believes herself to be alive and well. Oh. But it's over, isn't it? She stopped breathing moments ago, that arrogant look still plastered on her face. But is it over? Really over. Oh, this is the first time she didn't kill me. Uh, oh no. I'm so sad. I'm sorry. I feel bad about this one too. I, I honestly, I've enjoyed killing her many times. This one feels bad. Like she really wasn't expecting me to do it. Weird. Uh, can you read? Uh, did I miss one? I'm sorry. I'm so sad, yes. Oh no. Uh, we have to get the ending. Uh, this one, you have to press play the princess. Uh, no, we are slaying her. Said in complete silence. But the princess is your true love. Uh, oh no. Can you read? Why are you smashing a dead- What? Whoa, what? Uh... 
Oh, uh, Zai shall empty your compartments on your pantaloon. What? What? I think the chat went a little, a, a little wonky there. Um, we have to get this ending. I missed that one. Uh, the one you have. Blah 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 blah. blah. Uh, you might have to repeat yourself on that one. I'm afraid. The words on the top right. Okay, got it. It's kind of traumatizing. Smashing. Uh, of course it is. She's dead. Yes, exactly. It's over. With your work done, you make oh. your way back up the stairs, closing the door to the basement behind you. Why do I feel like we've done something terrible? You did kill someone. Greater good or not, something would be very wrong with you if you didn't feel at least a little bad. But it was for the greater good. One of these days that will sink in and help ease your guilty conscience. But that day isn't today. Let's just get out of here. Okay. You open the cabin door, ready to return to a world saved from certain doom. Oh. You could have also gotten the brazer. Oh, did we not do the- did I not do it right? Only, a world saved from certain doom isn't what you find. Instead, what you find- So sad, we're leaving the princess. All. Where a lush forest stood mere minutes ago, the only thing in front of you now is the vast emptiness of some place far away. What happened? We killed the princess. It's fine. It's just that you and the cabin are now far away from them. Don't worry. You'll be safe here. This is good. What? Everyone is happy. You'll be happy. Uh, right now, you could get the specter, but we're getting this ending. Okay. That's bullshit. Let me out of here. Oh, okay. Uh, I was kind of hoping I'd get better ending for saving the world. I'm a bath first. Okay, enjoy your bath. Uh, get clean. Scrub, scrub behind them ears. If you have ears. If you don't, I feel your pain. Do the third one. Okay. I'm on it. I was kind of hoping for a better this isn't ending. ending. In fact, now that the princess has been slain, endings are a thing of the past. No. This is the beginning of eternity. This is what's best for everyone. Trust me. Oh, I don't trust you. Time passes. You can't be sure if it's days or months or years or even decades. It's all a wonderful, boring blur. You've never been happier. I feel... So, hey. Ooh. We're not just going to stay here forever, right? Uh, do the third one. Uh, see you later, White Shark. Uh, I don't want to go into the long quiet. Bathe well. Spoiler warning. Did you know that four star, you are the long quiet? What? Uh, didn't you hear the narrator? I'm happy. We're all happy! Hell no. Do you have any idea of how to get us out? Of course we are. I like it here. Can you read the words, please? Uh, see you later, White Shark. Uh, spoiler warning. Did you know that... Four Star... Uh, see you later. Do the third one. Uh, oh, I think I think we might be having some delay. <laughs> First one. Didn't you hear the narrator? Are we really happy? Or is he just telling us that we are? Hmm. Okay, maybe I'm not happy. And I'm not just saying that because you're the last person I talk to. Uh, no, we're happy. I'm sure of it. 
Spoiler warning, you are the long quiet. I am the long quiet. Well, just because I go silent for a few days at a time doesn't mean I'm a long quiet. It just means I have social anxiety and I don't want to talk to you people anymore. Uh, second one. The lore is com compatible. Is it? Uh, the second one. No, we're really? happy, I'm sure. Well, if you ever change your mind, just let me know, I guess. Okay. More happy time passes, though the word begins to lose its meaning. Time, that is. Not happy. Happy still has plenty of meaning. Happy, happy, happy. Please, shake yourself out of it. We have to get out of here. The little voices, please, fall on deaf ears. Uh, the lore is compatible. I wish I didn't hear this. That. Uh, it means we are good. We're God at the end. No, I don't want to be God. I want to be in love with God. Pass into a blissful state <laughs> oh, of pure existence. Though words like <gasps> eventually and pass ceased to have any meaning to you long before that shift. Okay, I've got a weird question. We exist. Happy. Do we become the narrator? Sorry, God. Oh my God. <laughs> you have already committed to my completion. You cannot go further astray. You saved everyone. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was a good one. I'm I'm glad we got that. Uh, that would be wild. Oh, I'm sorry, Sun God. I thought you were saying sorry to me for being your God. Uh, that would be wild. Um, okay, well, we only have this good. option. Because I have an idea to get us out of here. Though you're probably not going to like it. Oh, you have to do it when you first get on the game. Oh, okay. Sorry. I, I didn't do that. I didn't know there was uh, pretenses to the first playthrough. The blade. We can use the blade to get out of this. <gasps> I can hear everything you say, little voice. There's only one thing it would want you to use that blade on. And I'm afraid that thing is you. Looks like you're getting the specter and possibly the wraith. We haven't gotten He's those right. either. Uh, we did get the Spectre once, but then I screwed it up. Do you hear that? It wants to take this happiness away from you. It wants this wonderful place to end. Do you not? There's more for us to do, and the only way for us to do it is to take that blade and use it. Looks like you're getting the Spectre. Uh, dang, autocorrect. I said completely complicated. Okay, I was wondering what compatible meant, but I kind of thought... Don't that you that was your way of saying, yeah, that's all checks out. Don't you dare. Anything to get out of this hell. Uh, wouldn't using the blade, you know, kill us? Wouldn't we be dead? Undo what? Uh, does it matter what we choose here? I'll, I'll, I'll wait and let, uh, let you continue leading our way, Kenneth. As this is you, you are... The, the primary voice, and I'm just the one that sometimes messes it up. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, I'll do that right now. Oh, I'm still, I'm still a dinosaur. We got to fix that. We got to be something different. We got to grow. We got to evolve. We got to go with everyone's... Oh, I pushed the wrong... Oh! <laughs> I pushed the wrong button. Okay, there we go. I should now be a majestic starfish. Um Give me one moment, please. Go for it. No no rush. Uh looking at the wiki. <laughs>
I keep pushing F1, I'm sorry. All right, I got it. I did it. Undid it. Uh, Patrick Starr. No, I'm not. I would never copy someone else's product. Uh, first one. Except you're green. But to be honest, it doesn't matter. Okay. I'm back, I guess. Welcome back. I'm Starfish. Uh, anything to get me out of this place. Thank you. I made this happy little place for you. Is this not a good enough reward for saving the world? An eternity of bliss? You, you ingrate. Look, I've spent millions of years locked in a Fine. container, Whatever. so. For the first time since time. Oh, oh me, no, she's going to turn into that horrible little thing, isn't she? Space. Where she haunts me. The princess's body is oh. dust and bones, though the blade you used to slay her is still as pristine as the day you first held it. Thank you, narrator. You pick up the blade, you stab yourself, and you die. <laughs> that the was end. so bitter. Nice knowing you. Not you, narrator. Uh, the narrator is mad at you. <laughs> yeah, he does not. And at the end doesn't of seem happy. Is a cabin, and in the basement of that cabin is a princess. There's always a princess. Uh, I didn't see our ending. You're what did we get? To slay her. I was reading chat. If you don't, yeah, he is mad. The end of the world. This time you buried the princess. Did I bury her? Chapter two: The Specter. Who's excited for this one? This one is the one that I got the first time we played, but I turned around and left instead of doing anything. Uh, instead of. Yiffing her? I, I don't know what that means. I'm excited. Uh, chapter two. Okay. Just make sure I got caught up. Um, all right. Uh, what do we, what do we do? What do we do here? Which, which way do we go? Does it matter? Or is this one of those, uh, I'm damned if I do damned if I don't situations. Uh, someone in this chat was trying to do the deed with a dead body. What? IRL? No, that's bad. Ow. I just kicked my knee against the... I'm so angry I kicked myself. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean... I don't approve... But at the same time, we are kind of feeding corpses to a god who doesn't have a body, and I assume is building a body out of the body part, so we'll we'll see what happens when we get there. I think you proceed. Uh does not go to the cabin just yet. Get information. Okay. Oh, you bastard, you're in for it now. Oh, I'm wise to your tricks. This is new. Tricks. What on earth are you talking about? We've just met for the first time. Oh, you want to see meat for the first time? I remember what happened then. Maybe that sounded like an innuendo. That's fine. <gasps> it wasn't very hard to kill her last time. We'll just do it again. The cold. I haven't seen this voice. Well, if for whatever reason you're going to insist that this has happened before, at least your heart's in the right place. Uh, do not go to the cabin just yet. Get information. I'm going to get some groceries. I'm fine to be back in no time. Okay, well, have fun. Be safe out there and uh, pick up something nice for yourself. Uh, message retracted. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, let me play a, grind a grinding stage that only appears at 12 p.m. Oh, yes. Uh, the good old 12 p.m. grind. Uh, make sure you tell him about the void, like when you were at. The cold is not my top favorite, nor my least. He does seem kind of mild for someone so cold. Uh, let's assume I'm telling you the truth. 
Those are two very different questions, but fine. I'll indulge you if that's what it takes to get you moving. Okay. Let's say for a moment that this really is the second time you've met me, or, or at least a version of me. Yeah. If you're back here, I'm assuming you died, which probably only happened because you didn't listen to me. No, it we happened because I did. You plenty. We slew the princess just like you asked us to, and then you locked us away in an empty void for eternity. So we slew ourselves, too. Well, if you killed yourself, then you weren't listening to me, because I would never want you to do that. Believe it or not, I care about you. And I believe your other question was something along the lines of, Oh, what's the point of doing anything? If you're asking that, <laughs> well, that's okay. like you're making the rather dangerous assumption that your actions last time around didn't have any consequences. What do you mean? Of course there weren't any consequences. We slew the princess, the world outside the cabin disappeared, we died, and now everyone's right back where they started. That sounds pretty consequence-free to me. Yes, but in this purely hypothetical scenario, that begs the question of how you got back here. Did time simply rewind itself, or were you instead transported to a different world entirely? Uh, that's a good point. I think he, I think he said that to us before. Had you failed to but, slay the princess, what would have happened to everyone in the place uh, you oh, left? Make sure you tell him about the void, Starfall. Uh, the cold is not my top favorite. Uh, the cold reminds me of the broken, but better. Don't really remember that of the voice. Yeah, he kind of seems more like a he doesn't care, like the cool kind of character. Like, he, like emotionless almost. Which is not my favorite kind of character. Emotions are important. We didn't fail to slay her. And if she's really back, which I doubt, it'll be just as easy to do it again. But after that nasty trick you pulled on us, maybe she's not the only one around here in need of slaying. Okay, hang on. Sorry, I went to take a drink and I spit it out when he said he threatened the narrator. Maybe this is one of the good voices. <laughs> um, seven. I'm back. Hello, how are you? How are, how, how uh, was your, sorry, uh, four. Ooh, the cold hates the narrator. I know, I'm into it. Um, so, okay, so we've technically told him about the void, so let's see how this continues. Okay, so I guess we just proceed to the... Let's talk about this princess. Uh, if anything in the world in, uh, ended after I slew her, when I tried to leave, everything was gone. That's a good point. How do we know... We didn't have things backwards. Maybe slaying the princess was what ended the world, not the other way around. Yes. Maybe this whole thing was a trick to get us to end the world. And now we get to go through the whole charade again, wholly aware of what's waiting for us at the end. You know what's interesting is I actually thought that, I think, during our first playthrough, and I didn't proceed this route <laughs> properly. I didn't question anything. Uh, voices of the cold is wanting to slay the narrator. That would be fun. Actually, the whole game just shifts entirely to us going to kill the narrator. That's assuming she's alive in that cabin. We did kill her, after all. You're going to find her in the cabin. If the princess had actually been slain, you wouldn't be here. And let me assure you, killing her will not end the world. I don't know what you think happened to you last time, but it's a load of nonsense. You'll get your happy ending. I promise. Well, that's exactly what we're afraid of. Oh, that's Living a good point. Happily ever after sounds that bad to you. Oh, well, there's no use arguing over your masochism. The cabin awaits. Uh, last time around, I stabbed her in the heart. She died. And how can someone like that end the world? Uh, who locked her in that basement? Uh, let's she do that. Can. You'll have to trust that what I'm saying is true. The first one you were going to get was called The Nightmare. Oh, so this is different? Oh, okay. 
Uh, what? Lo- That's right, because our voice was like the terrified, swimpy voice. Uh, locked her in the basement. What is this place? People locked her in that basement, and I told you what this place is. It's a path in the woods. Don't overcomplicate things. See, when somebody says that, you probably should start overcomplicating things. Uh, also, in the first of your Pokemon Fusion shorts, you were stuttering while saying... <laughs> Is this the trick? Do you want me to stutter again? Because I'm going to. Uh, Hatsun, Hatsune, Hatsune Miku. The word is that easy. How is it to pronounce? Hatsune. Uh, I don't like the nightmare. The nightmare was horrifying. Uh, that one, like, she, like, turned into, like, a horrifying phantom and just killed me. Like, without doing anything. Uh, you're being cagey. If people locked her away, why couldn't they slay her? I'm not supposed to say this, but it's because you're special. You're the only person capable of doing this. Call it a prophecy, if that helps. But it's just the way things are. Okay. Oh, I didn't know we were special. <laughs> of course we're special. Oh. You're being cagey. You everything you need to know. Going into more detail will just overcomplicate an otherwise very simple situation and make your job more difficult. Uh, you haven't even gotten to the cabin. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I'm taking it a little slower. Uh, wait, do you have you seen the paranoid before the stream? I don't know if it was the paranoid or not. Uh, more like herd. Uh, share the first time she did kill you, but by shutting down your organs, but the second time you didn't go in she was more creepy than, oh, yeah because uh, she turned into like this ghost in like the first chapter, then I got to this point, I was like, you know what, I'm not going back there, let's see what happens if I go back this is and then the world boring. ended he's clearly not interested in talking so let's just do as he says, and maybe he'll stop bothering us. Good point. Okay. Great. Now we... Uh, let's proceed to the cabin then. A warning before you go any further. I think it might have been the paranoid. Maybe. So yes, you heard the uh, paranoid. Okay. You. I, I wasn't sure if it was like the paranoid or the dickhead. Uh, but he was like, how, how can we stop something that can just stop our heart? And I'll have to go back and look at that. A warning before you go any she further. She will lie, she will cheat, and she will do everything in her power to stop you from slaying her. Okay. She won't be a problem. Ooh, I don't like this voice. I mean, he's not as bad as, like, the, the, uh, whatever you call it. He's just the arrogant. The the cabin is cold. A soft odor of dirt permeating the air. Cobwebs flutter in the corners. You can hear wind whistling outside, banging the shutters against the windows. The only furniture of note is an elegant antique table with a pristine blade perched on the edge. Okay. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. It feels like no one's been here for a long, long time. Like I've been saying, she's dead. We killed her already. Okay, the whole cabin is different. Um, is there is there any direction? Does it matter? Uh, very nice. Uh, so there are two choices you can do. Is anybody else getting a chill up their spine? <laughs> this does have very creepy vibes. This kind of makes me think of uh, some other horror games that we've done. Like you just kind of have that creep. Um So yeah, we 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 can uh I'll I'll let you guys kind of fill out where you want to go into the basement without it, approach the mirror, take the blade. It's not that creepy. Yeah. I mean, it's it's hard to get super creeped out with like the sketchy vibes, but 
it does have that real creepy atmosphere going for it. Like, I feel like if there was like a chance of something jumping out at me, I would be a lot more creeped out. I, it would definitely be creepy. I won't spoil it. I remember this one now. I'm not going to spoil it. Okay. Uh, do you want to race or end this one early? Uh, let me just check the time. If it's it's 11, 12, um, it doesn't super matter. At this point, <laughs> it doesn't super matter. I've I've kind of I've kind of overshot my my original goal here. And I did have my coffee, so we're 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 good on energy. Oh no. I've got I suddenly have this horrible feeling we're going to be running into something that's not very pretty. Oh, this is going to go poor. Race. <laughs> Kill the princess. Bring me her soul. The Rafes. The race first good. Race is good. Okay. Uh, okay, Mr. Turtle, everybody has spoken. You're taking the blade into the basement. All right. You take the blade from the table. It will be difficult to slay <laughs> the princess and save the world without a weapon. Yeah, I can't wait. Oh, this is actually the ending ending, is it? You didn't say anything about the mirror on the wall. Uh, into the basement. Oh, the mi mirror just disappears if you don't look at it. The door to the basement groans open, revealing an old banister and a creaky wooden stairwell. Oh. Everything is coated in a thick layer of dust, and you can feel it settle into your lungs as you breathe in the stale air. The very building itself feels dead. If the princess lives here, slaying her would probably be doing her a favor. Uh, I'm a spoil a little bit, but you're going to have to kill her. But don't do it immediately. Okay, the got it. Below is silent. Nobody's here. Naturally. As much as I appreciate the optimism, you shouldn't be so sure. I guess we'll just have to go down and see. Oh, spooky ghost. You oh, she is stone, dead. The form of the princess comes into view. A skeletal body lying in a heap on the floor, its wrist still bound to the wall by a thick chain. Seen, Mr. Narrator, you don't know everything. Okay. She's definitely dead. Hmm. It's just like I told you. Before oh, you no! Thought, the top of her head appears. Two deep-set eyes stare up at you. Oh, she's kind of cute. A mischievous skeletal grin. You know what? She's kind of cute. Um. <laughs> so we are waiting to kill? Uh, yes, unless you do not want information. Buried a skeleton. Uh, the narrator is very confused as why she's dead. She is so cute. She is so cute! I was expecting a horror show! And finally, the rest of the body floats up to join the head. Wait, this isn't right. What's going on here? I killed her! And now she loves me. G oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was that was too funny. I liked that. I liked that little bit. Um Smash or pass a ghost. Pass. No, that's a smash if I'm dead. Um I would say pass on the ghost thing because I'm pretty sure ghosts suck your life force out. Oh, wow. How absolutely terrifying. <laughs> What's a ghost supposed to do to us? Oh, it's you. Hiya, Keller. Oh. I was hoping to see you again. I have some issues with how our last meeting went. 
Is it because I didn't, you know, plant a beautiful kiss upon your cheeks before I killed you? The princess drifts across the room into your orbit. Oh, her, her chain her is still there. Your shoulders and down your neck oh, that's actually kind of creepy. Okay, actually... She's cold and ethereal, formless, yet real enough that her icy fingertips send shivers dancing. That is a bit chilling. The, the, the sound is very good. Um, wow, the voice of the hero is such a hero right now. <laughs> uh, don't worry, it was all because of me, the ghost. So she has a body, and she's right there. That means we could kill her again, if we wanted to. That, that scar on her chest makes me think of bread. Uh, wait and see how things play out. Uh, is that what we want to do? Don't worry, it was all because of me, the ghost killer. Uh, the chat is like one of the voices right now. Yeah, it, it, everyone's, everyone's got their own deal. Half of them want me to, uh, smash. Uh, which, if they ever put that in the game, that's gonna be very concerning. Uh, slay the princess. Uh, that's... That's hot if you just look at the body. Honestly, she kind of makes me think of like somebody who's put like the skeleton paint on. She's got too much flesh to be a proper skeleton to me. Um, all right. So are we good killing her then? <laughs> are we good stabbing a ghost to death? Just try to slay her. Okay. All right. A moment's hesitation, oh. you lash out with your blade. Spooked me. It's like you're slashing. Oh. Dead. No matter how many times you stab at her, no matter how many angles you strike from, all you manage to do is interrupt her form, the skin of your hand prickling with That actually makes sense. Through, unable to find anything solid. Hmm. Hmm. You're adorable when you're confused. Oh, thank you. That means I'm always adorable. <laughs> you. You're such a charmer. Oh God, I skipped that. What happened? Just making sure you finished the job, or what? I said that so he could get a jump scare. Uh, I fucked up that jump scare, but it still scared me. <laughs> Fuck me. Uh, just try to slay her. Oh my God. I'm going to go for a while. Uh, all right, we may not be here for too much longer, but if you're if we are still here when you get back, uh, if we're not here when you get back, have a wonderful day. Uh, I said that so he can get a jump scare XD. Uh, bro, he got jump scared so badly he doesn't know what she looked like. I'm sorry, I fucking clicked the button so fast. Uh, let me just check the history here and see what she said. Uh, you're adorable when you're confused, but I don't say, but I didn't say you could touch me. Oh, okay. That's actually very, that's a valid response, honestly. Uh, explore. If I knew I'd have to talk to you again, I wouldn't have slain you. <laughs> I'm sorry, that is like the best response. Listen, if I knew you were going to haunt me or you were going to survive, I wouldn't have killed you. I died too, and I'm not floating around like you. Are you what happened? Why am I different? Why are you different? Stop playing the victim. You threatened me last time. Uh, of course I attacked you. You're supposed to end the world. That's why I killed you last time. Uh, you're dead, or at least mostly dead. What can you even do to hurt me? What do you want from me? Uh, okay, team. <laughs> I'm out of ideas. Thoughts? Slay the princess harder! <laughs> oh, good wording there. Uh, fine, if I can't hurt you, then uh, really isn't anything for me to do here. I guess I'll just get going. Leave. Um, alright. Sorry, let me check, check, chat again. Uh, 
You did not see her face. It looked like it turned into like a horrible red skull from what I briefly glanced. Um, I don't want to be mean to her. Uh, yeah, that one. I died like you, but I'm not you. Okay, got it. Uh, I died too, and I'm not floating around. Don't look dead, killer. Oh, well, neither do you, actually. The princess you grabs your wrist, a sudden shock of cold flowing all the way up your arm, her eyes still fixed on yours as you try to squirm out of her grip. And you don't feel dead, either. You don't either. You just feel cold. She lets go and pulls away. Your fingertips tingle painfully as the chill subsides. Oh. I'm less interested in why you are, or how you are, and a lot more interested in what you are. Oh, really? I've tried to leave on my own. Before you came back to me, I explored every inch of this place, if even the spaces between the walls. But I never found a way out. I always wound up right back here. Just be prepared. Oh, God. I just want to go home. I'm so cold and alone here. Oh. But you can come and go as you please, can't you? So, let me hitch a ride. Oh! <gasps> can we be loved ones together, you and me as one? So when we get back to our God, my true love, I don't have to feel bad about your death? Uh, I like how her voice echoes. It is, it's really good. Oh, shit. Okay, Pennywise. I'm on to your game now. I almost clicked again when it happened. Uh, do not have your hand on the keyboard. <laughs> I almost did. I almost clicked it. Absolutely not. What? Why not? Is she asking if she can possess us? It might be, like, really good. She like, is. fun. And I hope I don't need to explain why you can't let that happen. She's so it cute right now. <laughs> catastrophic if she managed to escape this place. And if you let her in, there is very little anyone could do to stop her. Uh, that, that horror face, you know? Yeah. I get it. I get it. Would she be able to see us if we went along with it? Oh, that's a good question. Now, isn't that an interesting thought? We could finally bring her <gasps> face to face with him. I wonder what she would have to say to the one who wants her dead so, so badly. Uh, when there is an option, wait for me. Okay. You won't like how things play out if you go down this path. Uh, what if I say no? This wouldn't just be temporary, right? Or this would be temporary, right? You'll leave once you're out of this cabin. Uh, if I let you in, do I still get to be in control? Uh, before I agree to anything, we need to talk about what happened after you leave this plane. I was told you'd end the world. Uh, sounds great. Do it. Let the princess possess you? The answer is no. Return, I need to think on this. Oh yeah, she would hear them if she possesses us. I'm kind of interested to see what would happen to the narrator. Uh, but, but we'll wait, we'll wait and see uh, what Kenneth would like us to do. Seeing as I kind of ruined the blade ending. Okay, just get information and then let her possess you. Gotcha. Uh, this is great. Going to be temporary if I let you in. Uh, before I agree to anything, we need to talk about what happens after you leave this place. I was told you would win the world. And what? You just believed that? You killed me without giving it any thought? Of course not. That's I thought cool. plenty about killing you. I... That... Once again, I may not be entirely sane. Every time she touches us, it's like we freeze over. She's right, though, but that's neither here nor there. What's done is done. 
What we do from this point forward is all that matters. Let's try not to let emotion get the better of it. Very well. Uh, explore when were you going to do it? Uh, what are you going to do if I help you get out of this here? I don't know. Maybe I'll, Maybe I'll just fade away. Oh, I hate that. I Maybe don't know. I'll be able to rest once I'm free from my unfinished business. Maybe I'll find someone to haunt. Oh. Maybe I'll haunt you. Oh, that sounds more... I mean, if you're possessing me, what does it matter? It's a tough question. Asking someone what she's going to do with her life. Afterlife. The princess leans in close and pauses. This looks like she's leaning back. Between you, stale and unmoving. Especially when <laughs> Jesus. Dead. She pulls back with a playful giggle. <laughs> I don't think most living people could answer that either. Does anyone actually know who they are or what they want? You know, the whole playful ghost thing, I think it's supposed to be creepy, but, and I'm going to regret saying this, so nobody is allowed to clip this. Um, it's kind of cute. It's, it's kind of got a cute vibe. Uh, every time she says cold, I think of the voice of the cold. Uh... All right, everybody, do you want which one? Um, I think I'm the only one, so here. Uh, leave, I guess. <laughs> uh, pro, that gave me a heart attack. I forgot about this without one. I'm clipping that. No! Don't do it! <laughs> My livelihood! My bosses will find it, and then they'll, I don't know, make fun of me or something. <laughs> Okay, so we want to leave? <laughs> uh, you didn't answer my question. Do you want to end the world? Where are you going to end the world? Where? Well, where were you going? Fuck. I don't know. I just oh, I hate leave. that. I don't know. I still just want to leave. It reminds me so much of the damsel. I don't know. Uh, you didn't answer my question. The only thing I've ever wanted was to leave this place. It's still the only thing I want. Okay, uh, I'm joking, although I'll second one. No worries, I'll be probably be the one clipping that. <laughs> um, second one. Return, leave at that. No, first one. Okay, got it. I'm going to put you up here. And you will also be up here. Okay, fine. You know what? You two just get down then. <laughs> All right, uh, first one. You didn't answer my question. Even if you don't want to end the world, does letting you out of here mean the world is going to end? Okay. I mean, I guess we kind of know I'm that. I'm asking you. We've heard your whole speech already. I really, really don't, don't know. know. I'm not lying to you. I promise. The world doesn't matter. All I like remember is that I'm supposed to be... Oh, the there, echo. Not here. I'm just, just supposed to be a part of it. It's its home, I think. Oh my god, that close-up. Ugh. But what does it mean for anything to us? It's got that, that ASMR feeling. Uh, I'm back. Welcome back, Shark. Uh, I have fallen. <laughs> I can't get up. Uh, welcome back. Hello. Um, we're going to have a lot more stuff going on with the Avatar thing, by the way, uh, in the future. Uh, that's something I'm going to be working on this week, and we'll slowly start adding stuff. That's just a quick cam cameo caveat. Uh, 
Uh, but what does it mean for anything to end? Okay. Uh, we can slay her. And you ended and you too. Ended too. But, but here you are. are. And you don't, and you don't even look any different. different. I'm not so sure endings are real. No, there's definitely an ending. All right, it's time to... Oh. Oh, wow, there's a lot of options. What the hell? If you're dead, then there really isn't much for me to do. Okay, I don't think I read all of these. Technically, you don't, but it pisses... Okay. All right, here we go. We're gonna slay her. <laughs> Without a moment's hesitation, you lash out with your blade. It's like you're <laughs> this is so stupid. No matter how many times you stab at her, no matter how many angles you strike from, all you manage to do is interrupt her form. The skin of your oh, it just does the same thing. As cold as it passes through. Hmm. You're adorable when you're confused. Oh, it just so you could touch me. Yeah. Okay. She just does the same thing. Here, just making sure you finish the job, or what? I don't actually know why I'm here. If I knew I'd I'd have to talk to you again, I wouldn't have done it. Uh no. Yes. <laughs> uh, all right, so killing her doesn't work. Oh, fine. If I can't hurt you, then there really isn't anything for me. To oh, that's the same one. Okay, I give in. It's enough is enough. The answer is no. I can't let you out and I won't let you possess me. Or let the princess. That must be a bug slayer again. Okay. You swing at the princess once more. And I bet if we do it enough, it'll work. Her voice chides from oh, elsewhere in the room. It changed. You whirl around, finding her hovering between you and the basement stairs, looking you over with grim disappointment. She draws in close. I was willing to let bygones be bygones, killer. I was willing to ignore everything you did to me so we could get out of here together. All I ever wanted was oh. to leave this place. Oh All no. I ever wanted was to find a way back home. Wait, you have a home? Wherever home is. Oh, okay. Her eyes turn from oh, she was crying to pits of wrath as she stares into you. A pits of broth? Mmm, that sounds delicious. <laughs> less delicious, less delicious. Uh, she mad. Say good night. Oh God. She forces her hand into your chest, and then <gasps> she touches my heart. Nothing happens. Oh. Are you sure about that? So something should have happened, and yet it didn't. We're fine. Okay, now I'm confused. Oh. Did she miss? I'm not afraid of you. Stare at her in silence. Step away. She's crying. I, yeah, I saw her cry. That was sad. <laughs> the voice of the hero is scared. Yep. Uh, actually, bye now. Okay, bye. You have a wonderful day. Take it easy. And uh, have have just to have a wonderful day, you know. Go out there and make a difference in the world, or or don't. Step away. You do your best to pull away, but it's as if her arm embedded in your body is rooting you in place. Ew. So oh. You can't be sure if you first hear or feel what happens next, but it is over before you can fully conceptualize what it. Is. Oh, the oh. Splintering, the squelching of organs, the mm. rending of tissue, an icy, numbing pain. Not even a kiss goodbye. I'm to pass you. The next time I see you, I'm taking everything I owed. Starting with your body. If you won't choose to give me my freedom, I'll just have to make you give it to me. Okay, I liked you when you were being kind you of the cutesy the ghost. You should return the favor. <laughs> Slay the princess or die? I think she's in the middle of possession. 
Oh man, I, f I feel like we're gonna do that swiping thing. She's just gonna be motherfucker. <laughs> uh, slay the princess. It'll happen this time. Definitely gonna work this time, right? You swing your blade towards her briefly corporeal throat. <laughs> it connects. <gasps> A gash widens across her what? neck, glowing ectoplasm leaking from the wound. But it's too little, too late. I didn't uh, actually want to hurt her! She clutches your still beating heart. It thumps unsettlingly. I feel like her getting this kill was like karma, karmatic, karmatic, j karma, just karma. Even if we didn't. You've given her something to remember. My heart. See you soon, killer. Oh, you will. I'm afraid you'll never know. As she crushes your precious organ in her hand. Poor little Mr. Turtle. Goes dark. You do not have a it's choice. <laughs> Ew. It's not gross. Hearts are perfectly good for you. They're they're healthy. The wraith. Against time. You're on a path Ooh. in the wood. And here we go again. Off to slay her. Again. The deck's stacked, isn't it? We kill oh, her. Oh, the we cheated. Start again. She kills us as a goddamn ghost. We start again. I'm starting to think we're being run in circles just for the sake of it. It's called a wild goose chase. Come on. Let's not give in to all that misery just yet. There's got to be a way out of this. There's got to be a right answer. And what if there isn't? Aren't you listening to me? What if all of this was rigged from the start? I don't remember the cheated for some reason. I've never heard the cheated either. It's ridiculous. Well, my I have never heard There'd it. Be no but... point in all this if it was just some kind of cosmic busy work. I think that's exactly what it is. The powers that be seeing how many ways they can screw with us. Could be it's all some kind of sick joke to them. Oh no! I clicked off the screen. Oh, there we go. Uh, there Will we go. Get... I don't know. Boring. Okay, so you've already been here twice, even. Great. Then let me poke a few holes in your depressing little theory. Okay, do it. Nobody here is screwing with you, and I can't imagine any scenario where you would have started over after slaying the princess. Oh, I slayed the princess. Well, we didn't have to start over. Right. We killed ourselves. <laughs> yeah. And why, pray tell, did you do that? Uh, mostly did because the voices in my head told me to. Infinite tedium on us. Uh, will this video, will this stream be here to watch again? Uh, yes, it should stay up. The only thing is, I think for a little while, like right after the stream, it will be uh, only part of it until it processes. And then I will also probably be taking it, downloading it, and trimming it a little bit uh, for the sake of, like, releasing for, like, just people who didn't get to come and watch it. Or people who don't see, like, don't want to sit through, like, uh, a three or so many hour stream. So I'll probably be uploading that at another point throughout the weeks, coming weeks. So we'll see how that goes. That doesn't sound like me. If I'd had everything my way, you would have effortlessly slain the princess, saved the world, and been given your happy ending. Ooh, a happy ending, you say? The ending was the tedium. You locked us in a cabin and sent that cabin to an endless void. And then you told us we were happy. Make sure to keep all the good parts. Uh, I was actually going to be cutting any parts where there was communication or talking. Uh, so it's just going to be, like, several videos of silence while I do this. I felt like that would have been a better video. <laughs> well, were you happy? I was for a bit. we weren't happy. Oh. That's why we killed ourselves. It was <laughs> oh, awful. Oh, God. That's not a great sentence. It was boring. It was bullshit. It was bullshit. So you killed yourself. Yes. And then she killed us. Even though she was already dead. This is all fake. 
Okay, let's try to get back on track. You're real. The princess is real. The world is real. The people in the world are real. And the danger she poses to all of them is also, quite unfortunately, real. Bullshit. Whatever you did the first time, it sounds like it almost worked. So how about you give it one last try? Because killing yourself seems to undo all the good you almost managed to accomplish. Okay. Just standing around and talking is boring. Let's at least do something. Maybe we'll kill her again. Maybe we won't. Maybe we'll even free her. Ooh. And why should I? Uh, why should we help you? All you're going to do is lock us away forever again. Are you the same narrator we met on the other loops? You were quick to accept that we've been here before. That's actually an interesting question. Uh, we've killed her and been killed by her, and neither of those things uh, have gone well for us. If we're going to fall through the loop forever, eventually we're going to let her out. We might as well do it now. What happens if we don't go to the cabin? That's another option. Proceed to the cabin. There's something else we haven't tried. Turn around and leave. <laughs> Actually, we have tried that. Uh, first one. You could have given us a book and pencil. A book and pencil. What? Sorry, I didn't see when that part came through. Uh, first one. Explore, and why should we help you? Tell you what, I won't do that. <laughs> I promise. Oh, I'm happy then. Oh yeah, sure. That changes everything. It does. I mean, he did promise. <laughs> I'm, I'm with the hero on this one. Him. Are you the same narrator? Me and Kenneth are just chilling here. <laughs> Is it just you two? Let me let me give you guys something. Uh, in the void, it in the void, it was boring. You could have given us something. Oh, right. There you go. Now you guys have friends. Uh, yeah, true. Right now, I don't really like the voice of the cheated. He kind of reminds me of like an old man, kind of. Pah! <laughs> kind of old guy. Uh, you were quick to accept that way. Blah, 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 blah. Live forever eventually. We might as well do it now. Uh, what happened if we don't go to the cabin? Uh, are you the same narrator? We killed her and been killed by her. Fall through the loop eventually. Uh, I don't see an option here. <laughs> this, this is a very creepy path. And you believe him? Uh, I don't think the narrator remembers anything, lol. I don't either. I think he's just kind of going with us. If I had to make a wager, I'd say yes and no. That's a hedge, not a wager. <laughs> Bitch. I haven't met you, but you've clearly met me. It sounds to me like you're hopping between parallel realities, in which case the me you just met here is the same collection of experiences as the me you met at all of those other beginnings, but their continuity breaks the moment you say or do anything, in effect making them all separate. Okay, whatever, smarty pants. So, yes, I'm the same me, but ever since the moment we started talking, I'm different. I'm not sure how we're supposed to kill him ourselves, but he's asking for it. Yeah. Maybe there's some way she can take care of him for us. Oh. They've clearly all been through some harrowing experiences. Don't let their baggage influence your decisions. You have the ability to see things clearly. I suggest you use it. Uh, we're kill- we killed her. You're making a 
dizzying amount of assumptions. <laughs> Your perceived reality looping twice before does not mean it will continue to do so forever. Uh, I don't think the narrator remembers anything, lol. Ooh. Those little voices have already drawn attention to the fact that even the path is different. Turn around and leave. The world itself is at a tipping point. Know that there is always a choice. Even if yeah, you I'm really sure that the cold loop, very wants no to kill the narrator. To I'm starting to think so too. Force you to make any specific choice. You do have free will, as much as things would be easier if you didn't. And you can just keep making the correct choice forever, never deviating. How convenient everything always comes back to what you want us to do. I'm sick of him. Makes me want to end the world out of spite. Alright, so turn around? Alright, I'll give That's it a shot. Let's not kill him. Let's throw him someplace that never ends. I'd like to see what that does to him. Can we do that? Uh, there's something else we haven't tried. Okay. You have already committed to my completion. Oh. You cannot go further astray. We don't go to the cabin. That's another option. Okay, so the god can talk to us, right? I don't think the narrator. Oh, I'm reading. I'm rereading and rereading. Uh, yeah, I'm really sure Cold wants to kill the narrator. Yes, just once. Ooh, do we proceed? I think we have to. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and see what he says Did about she this. Find a way out on her own. Ugh, of course she does. So, standing around out here is the same as us letting her out. Yeah. Only we don't have to see her. That's got to be better. Right? Oh God! It's like an ex. Yeah, I just, I just really don't want to run into no, my ex. Be worse. But she can't kill us out here. Why would staying out of killing distance be worse if she's getting out regardless? Turn around and leave just once. Because it's cowardly for starters, and because the unknown is always worse than the known. But really, all you're doing right now is weighing two considerably bad options. The only solution worth considering is slaying her, and whatever delusion is holding you back from doing that is just that. A delusion. If you already managed to end her in some other world, the only reason Whoa. you'd be here is that you somehow managed to do it. <laughs> A lot of, lot of words coming into my brain at once. Uh, let me just check here. Uh, turn around and leave twice leads to cra grabby hands. The cheater sounds like he has to meet his ex. <laughs> uh, How are we supposed to decide on anything if you just keep coming up with new rules? Since when is there a wrong way to slay her? Oh, I don't have the choice to turn back around, I'm afraid. Uh, we must proceed. Uh, I hope you're reading ours out loud. Uh, I, I think we're just having a bit of a... A delay issue. Uh, the cheater sounds like that. Turn around, turn around and leave just once. Turn around and leave twice leads us to grabby hands. Oh, okay. So yeah, we do have to proceed. So you continue down the path towards the cabin. It isn't long before you're steps away from your destination. I don't think you need any words of warning. I think you know what's in there, and despite your protestations, I think you know what you need to do. The more he talks, the more I'm interested <laughs> in setting her free. I don't know. Do we want the cheated to feel like the winner Whatever. here? You don't want to listen to me? Do it then. Let her out. See what I care. Oh man, he's gone totally nihilist. It sounds like somebody's about to crack. Um... Are we trying to use reverse psychology on me, or are you just giving up? Uh, I have an, a small delay, but it's fine. Uh, yeah, I, unfortunately, that's kind of my internet. Uh, I've tried fixing it. Uh, I, I've tried setting the delay a little bit faster. Uh, so there is there is a slight delay between the chat and what you guys are seeing. Um, I've tried reducing it. One. There's okay. obviously no point in we'll trying to reason it. with you right now, especially with all these clowns offering up their useless advice. 
Honestly, it seems like the more I try and talk sense into you, the more single-minded they get about letting her out. <laughs> so yes, I'm done trying to argue. Okay. Would you look at that? We won. I don't know if it really is a win until we kill Take him. However you will. The interior Ooh. of the cabin is long and dark, a single narrow hallway <gasps> stretching far into the distance. Curtains billow out from tall windows. It's just the wind or the mirror obscuring the path forward, fluttering. There are two choices up ahead, Captain. Wind rush into the building, uh wow, the narrator called them clowns. <laughs> I was gonna say he's he's yeah, getting fed up with these guys. Hmm. That's strange. Oh More strange. Is it the mirror? The mirror? No, there isn't a mirror. What's strange is that there isn't much of anything in here at all, aside from the curtains. There's supposed to be a pristine blade. Why isn't there a pristine blade? Oh. Great. Something else has been taken away from us. Okay, Jesus. Oh, this is the one now. I really remember now. Oh. Yes. I suppose the only way to go is forward. So forward we will go. Blade. Oh, sorry. I went a little... Let's pretend there is a mirror at the end of the hallway, and that right now we can't see behind it. What's there? What's behind it? And or approach the mirror. No more stabby stabby. Well, shit. Um, do we want to find out more information? I love this one. Oh, is it really good? Number one, okay. If you're asking what's at the end of the hallway, it's the way to the basement. Okay. The way to the basement? Don't you mean door? No, I didn't say door. Because there isn't a door, it's just an opening. Oh. What are the odds she's waiting for us right behind it? If I were running a bullshit factory, <laughs> it's what Okay, I'd fair do. enough. Let me assure you that there's nothing there. Nothing is going to jump out at you. Certainly not the You son of a the bitch! Is in the basement. Oh, Can't that is definitely mirror. foreshadowing. Gone, defying his expectations. Who the hell is calling the shots here? Nobody is calling the shots. That's how reality works. All right. You oh no! The gaping maw that awaits. I you. hate this. Your fraying nerves buzz with trepidation. The chill wind raising your hackles. As Can the thumbnail be of you getting scared the with the, the second the one, ghost? You can't shake. Uh, depending on how you feel about this on. one. Uh, can the thumbnail be of you getting scared with that second ghost? It's a little scary. Uh, it, the thumbnail can absolutely be me getting scared of the ghost. Um, <laughs> I'm sure there's going to be a jump scare here. I'm going to have my hand off the mouse. You're watching us right now. Sometimes the feeling is just stronger than others. Oh, God. I feel like you're trying to put us on edge. We don't need all this anticipation. We just need this to be over. Okay. You stop as you reach the end of the hallway, I presume in front of whatever mirror isn't actually there. Here's oh that. no, she's in the mirror, isn't she? You reach <gasps> Shit! Into the pitch black of the oh. Ugh, oh, God. <laughs> it's like this place you motherfucker, don't hospital. say this! Okay, the thumbnail should be when you get your ankle broken. What? She is behind the mirror, lol. Oh. What you're looking at, kid? Mm. Staring into the void, thinking about what it'd be like to die again. I know exactly how you feel. Shit. Where is she? You feel something oh, like no. frigid coil around your ankle. Your heart oh, starts to beat, no. standing in muted shock for one long, frozen moment. Your bones. Ooh, that didn't like that sound. That was too. That was too loud for me. Icy pain radiates up from the break, a deep cold flooding your veins as your legs, numb with the shock uh. of it, collapse, and you collapse with them. Oh no. You're met with a terrifying oh, visage of the princess, no. 
Her hand grips your leg in a steel vice. That's not pretty. She's not cute anymore. Ear to ear, crowded with far too many long and crooked teeth. Oh no! I gave you a path to forgiveness. I gave you a chance to make things right. Nope. I don't like this one. <laughs> she looks so pretty. You. This should be the thumbnail. Yeah. Uh. God. I thought maybe you'd seen what you've done and feel remorseful. Maybe try to make it up to me. But no. You'd rather use that knife to keep making the same mistake over and over and over. Even after I ripped your heart out, you still cut me. And for what? <laughs> I didn't go anywhere. You didn't banish me. I'm right back here with you. A little better, a little worse. Well, oh. maybe a lot worse. That is a disturbing image. Yes, yes, you will be the thumbnail. So, here's how this is going to go. I'm going to take your body. And I'm going to walk it out of here. I don't know if I want you inside me. You get to watch me do it. Completely helpless. Just like you left me. Oh my god, also this is the first time we've seen our horrible bird feet. Everything about this scene is horrible. <laughs> uh do you think your love would like this one? I don't think she gets a choice. Okay. Don't even have a choice. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Have a choice. Maybe before, but not now. There isn't a blade this time. Exactly. What choice is there if there isn't a blade? Well, unless you have oh. specific ideas. More like painfully limping to the exit. Oh no! Look, we're even. <laughs> I killed you and you broke my leg. That's fair. Uh, and then you killed me. Water under the bridge. I never wanted to hurt you. I don't even know how I got here. I'm the victim of all this. You too, you know. Yeah, that's not a good response. Uh, wouldn't possessing me against my will make you no better than me? You don't have to be evil. You don't have to do this. Do you need to take my body? Can I just open the door? <laughs> uh, that's fine. I actually came here to free you. Struggle. Uh, what should we pick? Uh, one. Uh, this is the part when two choices come into play. All right. So we're going to go with number one. Look, we're not. We're even now. <laughs> okay. And you think that's even? How adorable. You broke my leg. But I think you forgot about the part where you tried killing me again. And you're breaking my leg! If I were you, I would just want to get it over with. Ooh, look at our feathery legs! Are we not wearing clothes? Now. You can either look on in horror or celebrate my freedom. But either way, you're about to become a passenger. Ooh. I think Kenneth is somewhat trolling while helping. <laughs> okay, that's totally fine. Trolls are great sometimes. A good, a good old-fashioned trolling is great. Okay, fine. Just do it. You know, troll trolls. I'd like to troll for them every once in a while. Like this. That's trolling. That's not trolling. That's just me abusing my commands. Whew. Okay. Also, a uh, <laughs> fun little fact. You guys are just all over these legs.
Um, you can pick anything you want. It's all your choice now. Great. Uh, I'm the victim. I, you victim broke my leg. As as Just because someone hurt you doesn't mean you get a free pass. Yeah, yes it does. You should be grateful that I still have a use for you. Being mine is more than you deserve. Babe. Wait, wait, why did you break my leg? If you want my body, it's going to be really hard for you to get out of here. Enough talking. We'll have plenty of time for chit chat once this place is far behind us. That's a good point. Wait, if you're in my body, do I have to look at your ugly face? Pinned to the floor oh, the that's not pleasant. The body emerges. Her proportions all wrong, limbs bent and curling, moving in ways that defy your uh, understanding. Uh, I guess we're all over the legs, yep. Uh, her torso stretches oh, why does she still have cleavage? Yours, her neck I hate that! Twists to look at you from a fresh angle. Oh, wait, that's that's her scar. That's her scar. Are you sure you can't do anything to help us? Can't you, like, manifest a rock right on top of her head? Yeah, narrator, why not? Along with her? Not that I even can manifest a rock. Besides, I thought you all wanted to free the princess. Nah, she'll hear them now. Okay. Like this. You don't even have a weapon, so I'm afraid you're out of luck, which unfortunately means that I and the rest of the world are out of luck too. Yep. And whose fault is it there isn't a weapon here? Yours, I assume. There's supposed to be a pristine blade. Whatever you did in those previous lives of yours, you really messed up. Yes, I did. Seriously trying to blame this on us. Uh, this scene is freaky. <laughs> it really is. Um, guys, I think the narrator's after you guys. Like, did you hear that? He said that you guys messed up, not me. Your face <gasps> oh, that's not. Open the of your soul. Oh, my soul has membrane? Get up. You're awake. Eyes once again fixed on the long hallway, your vision swimming as the princess's command reverberates inside your skull. Her voice is... Dang, we messed up. You feel... So cramped in here. Like there's some sort of growth trying to push us all out. Ooh, I don't like that I sound. Know. You rise to your feet, though the pain in your ankle is blinding. Your body slumps against the wall, desperately leaning into it for support. We got a new voice! If anything, it will be my fault. I will take the blame. There's another option, you know. <laughs> Oh, is there? Don't help either of them. Flip the table. Oh, I love flipping tables! <laughs> Ooh, I do not like this voice. It is it is not they achieved their effect. Oh no, she is with us now. That gap where the mirror was. I don't think it goes anywhere. <laughs> what? Let's throw ourselves into the abyss. Oh <laughs> that's so out of pocket. Hey guys. I don't think that door was even there. Uh, the voice sounded like, uh, the dredge. I'm not sure what the dredge is. It is an unsettling voice, though. Oh, God, it's like I have an ear infection. Ew! Still slumped against the wall, trapped between the princess's overwhelming will and the blinding pain of your split. We could jump or go to the door, I guess. Oh. Oh, that is going like deep down in my eardrums. I don't like that. I'm gonna kill myself. I hate that. In a single moment of overwhelming <laughs> willpower, you tear your. Here body comes two the choices. You can either or listen. No, I'm dying. I hate this. Capillaries burst and muscle fibers tear as you and the princess struggle over the reins of your body. Energy guys from the movie Titan. Firmly on the edge where the floor ends and the nothing hey. begins. It's unquestionable that her reserves are greater than yours, but fortunately for you, the distance you have to cover is far shorter. Titan A.E. I don't think I watched that movie. Enough is I'll have enough. to look at it. I'm tired of us always losing. It's just a step away. 
Go to the door. Hey, it's too late. I already jumped. I'm sorry. Ew. Throw everything you have against her and manage for one brief moment to overpower the princess's hold on your body. But that moment was all you needed. Your foot slips a few inches and you collapse forward. The darkness swallowing you whole. <laughs> we should jump. I'm sorry. Unfortunately, I've already jumped, Kenneth. I'm so sorry. I don't hate you, but well, now I kind of. Oh, this is. Oh, this is us falling. It's a long drop. I don't hate you. The thought slips through you, unheeded, as you fall and fall. Great. And fall. Now we have to talk with her in the void. <laughs> Yep. <sighs> Listen, my choices were go on living with her or die and live with her a little longer. But at least it's as an empire of frigid nothing. Voice of the cold. I this qualifies as saving the world, but at least you didn't ruin it. You're right, narrator. Now. We fall forever. I didn't want any of this. I just wanted to 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 be in love with my be in love with my. Just shut up. I don't know what he thinks happens now. That's not really good. I regret this choice now. Oh. And why is that? Oh. He's gone. But. <laughs> Terminal velocity ceases and you feel something. A mass growth torn out of you. You and the princess look at each other for a short moment. And then we each go in for a kiss. Sorry, I have to feed you to my true love. Oh, that's that's actually a really cool way to do this. Uh, dang, the narrator's gone. I regret this choice. OMG, your love is here. I know, I'm so happy to see her again! <laughs> but you didn't answer her before she's gone. And you feel the resistance underneath your feet. Once more, memory she's returns. Gone. Where did she go? Should we try and find her? Do not approach the mirror. This ain't canon. What? Why is it here? Why now? Uh, I don't think I have the choice not to approach the mirror. I would have kept them in the dark if I were you. Why? What is that supposed to mean? Whatever awful thing I felt before, it feels so much worse now. Oh god, so I guess. You're the real puppet master here. I can't believe I tried to help you. <laughs> Let me explain. Uh, don't approach the mirror. I will allow you to explain. Oh. Uh, go ahead, Kenneth. The stage is yours. This ain't the one you wanted. You were going to do something else, right? Or you can make this cannon and proceed to the mirror. Um. Oh. Hi, Cryo. I've picked you up. I'm just going to put you here for now. Um, I. Let's see, what time is it? So, I'll, I'll, I'll put this on you. It is now past midnight for me. Um, do you guys want me to proceed and talk to my true love? And uh, we can play the game again more. We can, I guess, restart the whole line. Or, 
would you like me to leave this here as an option later, like with a save? We'll, we'll add another save state here. Uh, which one would you guys prefer? <laughs> I just noticed that I put cryo in the middle of the scene. <laughs> Uh, we could go back if you want. Um, either way, we'll have to end it here. Uh, because I, I need to go to bed. <laughs> and uh, all that good stuff. Ten twelve. That's almost. Never mind. I'm not gonna say that. That's that's too much information. Cliffhanger, please. Okay. Yeah. That that actually sounds fair. So, we're gonna leave this one on a cliffhanger, <laughs> and we will come back. Um. Probably next time we stream, which may be Tuesday. No promises. I have to go to, uh, do some wound care stuff. Uh, but after that, I might do a stream. Oh. Okay. Oh, uh, all right. This will be canon. Dang. So Um oh no, my cat just threw something off the counters again. Give me a goddamn heart attack. Um I guess we can leave it off here. Okay. All right, so we'll go ahead and uh, that final final answer. We'll go ahead and do that. Uh we did save. All right. So with that, there are a couple of this will be the canon, and after this, when we were all done with everything else, we can just see all the other princesses and all that. Um, all right, so yeah, we'll we'll go ahead and we'll do this ending next time, and then we'll keep playing some more. That way, we have something to do on the next one, uh, and then we'll we'll take a look at all the princesses, and uh, then move back over to um, Silent Town. Uh, that said, we're going to go ahead and end it here. It's pretty late. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I didn't mean to go this late. Uh, I was actually planning on ending this at like 1030. So we went way over what I meant to do. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and call it there. Are you sure you want to quit? Yes. Uh, now, before we end this, I have a question for everyone. Um, it is in regards to the avatar, stream avatar. Um, I would like you guys to give me some recommendations on avatars you'd like to see, get options for gear, things like that you can play with. Uh, just any recommendations. It doesn't have to be right now. Oh, my gosh, it's 1 a.m.? It was 9 p.m. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, that's that's pretty late. Uh, <laughs> well, thank you for staying so long with us. That That is amazing. Uh, but uh, you don't have to answer right now. Just... Uh, at some point, you know, drop me a comment, leave me a thing. I need to set up a discord so that we can have stuff like uh, updates on all that as well. Uh, and I'll, I'll do that one day. But uh, until then, uh, right now we have a few avatars ready. Fancy hat suits and dinosaur head. Um, there is actually going to be a dinosaur avatar you can pick. Uh, I'm working on it. It just hasn't been completely animated yet. Uh, and it will have its own set of hats and gear as well. Um, we've got a few others. Um, I can't remember right now off the top of my head. Can it be free, please? Of course it can be free. I'm not going to make you guys pay for this stuff. It will absolutely. There might, there is a currency, uh, an in-app currency that you earn as you chat. 
uh, that you you do not pay real money for. There's there's never going to be. I'm never going to lock anything. <laughs> I have no money. Me either. <laughs> me either. You guys will never have to put real money into this. So see you next stream. Goodbye, Starfall. Thank you so much for joining us. I appreciate it. You have a wonderful night. See you later, Starfall. Um, you guys will never have to pay real money for any of this. This is uh there there is a slots thing on here that you guys can play with like the points you earn um that kind of thing it's not it's never going to be paid for i'm I'm never going to lock anything behind money for you guys um that's that's why i haven't set up memberships yet uh, i don't want to lock any any content behind a paywall so, <laughs> uh, but yes, it'll all be free right now. You guys have access to everything. If you want to go in there and look through it, uh, well, it's this stream's going to end. So you won't be able to at this point, but, uh, points are actually given to you, I think over time. And if you type exclamation mark slot and then space a number, uh, are the points going to be based for equipment stuff used for equipment? Yes. You can basically buy avatars. Uh, which I'm not going to lock anything behind. I'm not going to lock any main avatars behind anything. Uh, maybe some fancy color palettes, maybe something like that, or mostly accessories is really the only thing. Uh, points are also used to play the slots, which I will real quickly do that so you guys can see, or you can see, I think you're the only one here now. <laughs> um, I don't have the chat open here. Fuck. <laughs> Uh, let me do this. Sure, go for it. Oh, you're still here. Okay. Well, uh, all that applies to you as well. Uh, I'm just real quickly going to do slots. Uh, space. And let's say 10 cent. There is a way to see how many coins you have as well. One K. Do you have 1K coins? You get to see the narrator. What? Really? Oh, perfect. I'm, I'm very happy that. Uh, I'm not sure if I actually did the slot thing correctly. <laughs> uh basically I was playing around with it in um Super Beastos chat chat. It's true. Perfect. I really want to meet our true love. Perfect. That's that's great. I love that. Um but yeah, you guys um please let me know if you guys have anything that you want me to add specifically. And I will, I will try my best. Uh, I'm not the best 2D artist in the world, but I'm, I'm making these all by hand. So I have unlimited resources. Well, unlimited resources wrong. You're going to be surprised of what they look like. Oh, that's interesting. I, I'm not really sure what I was expecting. I was kind of expecting the princess just to look like a mashup of all the princesses or the god to look like all the princesses. As for the narrator, I didn't really think the narrator would ever have a form, but I'm kind of starting to think he is a, uh, a me. Very surprised. Oh. All right, that's good. I'm, I'm ex I like this game a lot. This is I, I didn't expect to be playing this so much, but um, I, I expected this to be a like a one video thing and then ended. But I'm really glad it wasn't. It, it was really worth. And there's supposed to be more endings coming. One of my top favorite ES right now. Favorites. Oh, <laughs> uh, the game. Yes, it's so good. I'm so surprised at how good it was. Like, uh, I, I was expecting it to be a pretty decent game, but I did not expect it to be this good. So, uh, 
Anyway, I, I, I should probably get going. It's, it's, uh, I've spent the last 10 minutes just playing around. So thank you all so much for joining me on this one. And I hope you guys have a wonderful night. We will see you guys again. I'll let you guys know if we're going to be doing Tuesday or just Friday and Saturday next week. Have a great day. Bye. My text. Very surprised. Why? Oh, about why I thought uh, that the voice. Uh, it's just something I kind of got the feeling since he's in our head, like the other voices. I assumed he's like a voice in my head. Uh, so if that's 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 just my reasoning. Uh, anyway, I I need to get going. So you guys have a good evening. Bye.